What is going on, John Hall? Welcome to the chat, buddy. What's going on, everybody? How is how's everybody doing today? Oh, and I, oh my goodness, what a noob. I left my laptop up again. I'm telling you guys, that's like four streams in a row I've done that. Welcome, welcome. How are you doing, John? We are at... I don't believe I've named this. I believe it shows me as discovered. Let's go ahead and name this thing. Sure enough. Let's go ahead and name this. Candy Corn Holler. Hope everyone's having a great night tonight. Alright, here we go. Cool, cool, got it done. Alright, guys. Well, basically, when we get a few people pouring in here tonight, guys, we're just going to be chatting it up a little bit tonight. It's going to be a heavily, uh, heavily stream chat night tonight guys because I'm going to be popping off reloads like a madman and we're going to be catching we're going to be trying to catch this S class candy corn holler guys what's going on Remus welcome buddy let's see good Saturday some zoology done while the daily event nice taking a late lunch early dinner break sweet I'm having a great day dude um I've actually uh, moved a couple of my accounts around to different areas of the galaxy basically uh, got some jump off points oh I hear you Remus <laughs> basically got some jump off points for the uh, you seen it in the discoveries guys the yellow star destroyer system so yeah so I actually hoovered hoovered two of my main save accounts or my main PSN accounts over to um, over to the yellow Hollow system. I used my second PSN account. I hoovered it over, started to base on it, and then uh, moved a couple of my secondary saves on my main PSN over to that system. So now I got all my systems set up to, uh, or got a lot of my saves set up to, uh, one, to help other people get to that system, and two, to, uh, to basically uh, try to get this. Uh, well, I, I was honestly, I'll show you real quick, guys. Uh, my freighter is still an A-class Star Destroyer on this save. This is the uh, save I started right before, well, no, no, no. This is my new next save. Cool, cool. Yeah, and it is uh, one of the only saves I got on this PSN that still has an A-class hauler. I thought about trading in the Agamemnon on my legacy save for the yellow hauler. And I just, uh, I seriously, I'm, I'm so, uh, I'm so torn about it because that, that, uh, Agamemnon, uh, freighter, sorry, freighter, uh, kind of, I'm kind of attached to it. It's kind of got sentimental value, so I really don't want to, uh, I really don't want to part with it, even for that cool, cool yellow holler, or yellow freighter, sorry. Uh, so I'm going to use this account and pick it up and we'll go from there let's see what we got going on here wanting to sleep but you haven't been to my stream for a while well dude i definitely appreciate you hanging out and staying up late with sword on saturday night did you do that with both ps4 i got two ps4s john hall uh three psn accounts and two ps4s so what i done was uh cloud saved all my data uh that i had on my main one that i stream off of uh, downloaded it off the cloud onto my second PS4 in the other room, and then logged on with my logged on with the account in here that had the location for the yellow holler or the yellow freighter, and joined the lobby with my second PSN account. Set a base up, got everything situated for it, then come back, um, come back on my second PSN account and joined it with my other saves off my main. So it was a little bit of a logistical nightmare, but it got done, guys. It got done. Let's see, cool, cool, cool. 
or join a friend. Yeah, well, I join, join myself. I'm my own best friend. <laughs> but yeah. Now, like I said, guys, it is going to be a stream full of reloading tonight because uh, I believe I got the yellow candy corn hauler um, during uh, Sunday during Zane's stream, and it took almost every minute of Zane's stream before I got that S class. So, what is going on, Lava Lamps? What is up, Funny Imps? How are you doing, guys? Definitely, definitely glad to have y'all tonight. Let's see. Cool, cool. You hoover yourself. Heck yeah, I do. I am omnipresent, guys. I can be all over the galaxy between my three PSN accounts. Exhausted after yesterday. Seven hours of reloading my freighter battle. No S clash. Oh, brutal lava. Dude, grief. Yeah, John Hall beat me to it, man. Very brutal. Nice sword. Yeah, that's what I would do if I had the scenario. Yeah. Well, I mean, like I said, it, it was a... Uh, it was, yeah, go Chiefs. I hear you, Meridius. <laughs> My brother's a huge Chiefs fan. Oh, it's so true. You can join yourself. Heck yeah. Uh, like I said, it, it makes it makes for very interesting, uh, very interesting logistics sometimes. And that's kind of why I don't really, uh, I don't try to have both my accounts in the same region of space at the same time because... That way I can kind of explore a little bit on one quad, one quadrant and explore a little bit on another quadrant and explore a little bit on another quadrant. And, and you know, if I find something really cool, I can use them to jump over. So I tricked out my Baltastic S-Class. Now it's my primary hauler base building ship. Nice, dude. Awesome. Yeah, yeah, Chiefs. <laughs> or yeah, yeah, Chiefs. <laughs> yeah. Well, you know, they, they got to have a good game every now and again, so go Chiefs. <laughs> Heck yeah. Alright, guys. And like I said, I might get lucky and this thing pop in on like the 10th or 12th reload. It wasn't that lucky on Sunday, but you never know, man. Another cool thing is I have a base set up near the... Uh, I have a base set up one jump away from the uh, yellow freighter battle, so depending on how long it takes me to get uh, takes me to get this uh, yellow candy corn or yellow and orange candy corn, um, if this thing pops up quick, guys, then I'm gonna go try to do something to get log in the time. I think I got probably an hour and a half or so logged in uh, on the save tonight quite a few warps so basically I'm gonna portal back to that base that I set up in the uh, outlying system and warp to uh, the yellow the yellow uh, freighter battle and see if uh see if I can pick that thing up in the S class probably not gonna stream at all but I'm definitely gonna try to get it done tonight guys which I'm in it for the long haul tonight guys I'm actually starting at 6 p.m. and uh I have nothing but time today guys Let's see. Thought they were about to give up a touchdown right there, but luckily they held on just enough. Nice, nice, nice. Who are they playing tonight? I didn't even pay no attention, guys. Let's see. I'm up 58 planets, soon to be 59. Zoology planets now. Only 41 more. Nice, buddy. What is going on, cuz Walt and all on the lurk? Nice, buddy. Much appreciated, the lurkers, guys. I'm telling you, you, you don't know. I just, I just love some lurkers because I do it myself, so I gotta love it. But heck yeah, man! Glad to have you, cuz. Just found a really nice hex wing holler, minimum slot. So, hmm, a hex wing. Hmm. I'm trying to figure out what you're talking about with hex wing holler. Oh, they're playing the Colts. Yeah, go Chiefs. <laughs> Yeah, man. Get sports is no fun without interlopers. Nice. Yeah, I, I I've been tempted to grab a couple medium haulers, man. Cause they've got they there's some really nice ones out there. But yeah, guys, I was on my basically I've been on No Man's Sky pretty much the whole day. I jumped on this morning, uh, shortly after breakfast and. Uh, 
let's see, the permanent key. Yeah, I hung out a little bit in the Lex checks or where well, really just uh Oh there he is. What is up, buddy? How are you doing? But yeah, I watched a little bit of a Lex check, was building a base, uh so I wasn't really that active chatting because I was concentrating. I was actually laying uh uh dropping plants in my biodomes and I was trying to do the math on my plants while while I was watching a Lex check, so <laughs> So yeah, I was a, uh, I've been lurking and uh, lurking and playing about all day. What is going on, Sci-Fi Guy Henry? How are you doing, buddy? Let's see, we call it the hex wing. <laughs> uh, let's see, no, cool, cool. Welcome, Alexi Check. Welcome, Sci-Fi Guy. Let's see, what hockey teams are those? <laughs> I hear you, buddy. If you run into, if you run into one this stream. I'll show you what I mean. Okay, buddy. Cool, cool. Heck yeah. What is going on? Getting your NMS fixed. Nice, buddy. What's going on, Blood Ravens? Man, slipped on in there. Almost missed you, but I caught you. I caught you. How are you doing, buddy? How is everybody doing tonight, guys? I'm definitely, definitely glad having everybody here. Holy moly. You guys just, y'all guys just surprised me. Just, just thoroughly surprised me I am uh, very happy to see 15 people watching at the moment and I've only been live 12 minutes guys come on 12 minutes holy moly but you know you guys are pretty cool people very generous oh come on with the troll ships check out this holler Alexi check what you think this thing is sick in the S class. I definitely love this. Love this holler. But, and then here's my nemesis. Well, I need to name this too. One on it. I think all my ship names got reverted on one of my saves. Let's see. Cool, cool. It's a magnetic sword. Oh, <laughs> uh, awesome. Dude, your sword, you're at four nine. I know, dude, I know. Three to go, dude. I am so chuffed about that. What is going on, Mike Stockton? How are you doing, dude? My week off of work almost over. Dang, brother. That is brutal. Needs blue glow. I know, man. That would make it perfect if it had a shielded ball or shielded containers, but I, you know, I. I I stumbled across this just out exploring the other day and definitely definitely an easy S class guys well I don't want to say easy but all you gotta do is sit here and reload your save it pops in on the first wave in a short runway uh, space station so pretty pretty much one of the easiest uh, S classes you'll normally run across in, uh, in No Man's Sky my new normal save all reverted to original names, planet system ships, but my legacy saves didn't get changed. I know, I know. What well, like um, I was looking at uh, today when I was on my second PSN account because I haven't played my uh, my 1701D account in a while. Um, I mean it has been it's been a minute since I've been on that account and and yeah um, and what basically what I'll be honest what basically got it all set up is. I had to get a new debit card, like, God, five months ago, because the uh, scan scan bar wasn't correct on my, or wasn't working on my old one, and it changed the card number when I got the new one, so I updated uh, my PSN stuff for like the PlayStation Store and and, uh, and PS Plus on my Legacy, my main account, but I never thought to do it on my on my second PSN account. And I downloaded Steep uh, like a week or so ago on my main uh, account, and my kid's been playing it. He's really liking it. But when I get home and I ha and I get to playing, I he has to get off, and he's fussing because it's a free-to-play game, and I got PSN on my second account anyway. I told him, so let me go download it. When I went to go download it, it said my card information wasn't right, and I just didn't want to be bothered with it. So when I got going this morning, I said, Let's go ahead and get that updated, get Steep downloaded. That way he can play it and goof off this afternoon when I'm streaming. So, yeah, that's why I was on, and then that's when it dawned on me, hey, I can move some accounts over <laughs> and grab a yellow, that yellow freighter, guys. 
because uh man that thing is a sick freighter and i really want it <laughs> all right let's see hey john how's you doing cool 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 you giving up nemesis for you giving up nemesis for this no 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 i've only actually only got uh two ships in this or i think two ships in this on this save guys yeah so i've got uh room for four more ships in the in the freighter guys so i'm just going to buy it when i get it let's see cool 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 bunny imps in shock <laughs> no 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 mr 250 is always awake explains the galactic catcher it's cool cool let's see oh what am i doing i'm i'm sitting here talking to you guys not reloading a save i'm actually at work night shift yeah man uh, this first wave mechanic was not working for me and my guy. Oh, man, that sucks, dude. <laughs> I was going to go into shock. No, heck no, man. No, at Nemesis Estate. I may, um, I may have to go get that Nemesis on, uh, I believe I already got it on Perma. I may go grab it on my new save, uh, when I go back to play my new, my new, uh, playthrough save but yeah it's definitely definitely a sick holler i love this one guys check this thing out let's see where we at here we go check out this sexy piece of work here guys that is one nice holler guys love this ship she is sweet all right let's see what's going on here guys Come on, be an S class. I need blue glows on my bio haulers. There's actually a few of them in Euclid. Uh, I've gotten, can't, I think it was my my main, my legacy second PSN account. I've got two um, shielded bio haulers in the in the uh, freighter. Really. The reloads weren't static. That sucks, man. Which, to be honest with you, unless it's a unless it's a pretty a pretty short uh tra a pretty short runway, and a uh, and a static first wave system, I'm gonna go down to the trade station anyway and start and hunt for a ship. It's just one the hunting is a lot faster because when you reload, you can scan if you kind of know the direction that they're gonna pop in at. You can basically, you can scan them almost as me, immediately as they pop in, wait for them to begin their circle around and make sure you've uh, checked them all and reload your save. So it, it speeds the process up quite a bit instead of having to wait for it to fly in as slow as possible into the space station. Bloated pigeon holler, I hear you. Nah, man, I love Nemesis. This, uh, this body style uh, in, in 1.3, it was the only it was the only white hauler that i seen on any forum in no for no man's sky before next dropped and i wanted a white hauler awful bad anyone else get the new ace combat 7 when it released i am going to i think it comes out friday afternoon i am going to buy it after i get off work and let's see it's next Friday afternoon, but I got to work. I was going to take the week, the following week off and just play it all week. But unfortunately, we had some scheduling issues at work and uh, they had already approved my vacation. But one of my one of my friends, well, he's my supervisor, but he's also my friend, come up to me and asked me if I would mind pushing my vacation back a week to help them guys out because they didn't have enough uh they weren't going to be able to cover all the stuff that had to be run out that week because of the holiday that was on. So I told him I'd push it back a week. So I'm going to have to wait a week and avoid all the Ace Combat 7 streams until I get it and start playing it. What is up, KJ? How are you doing? No, Mike, disappointing. The VR support might pick it up later, though. You both see so sword i learned something on your show that was that i was able to use to help someone on stream today they were having trouble getting selenium so i was able to tell them how oh cool cool and i learned that from ballista cola guys 
he was a uh, he was doing that stuff on his uh permadeath playthrough that super tough rule set uh permadeath playthrough and yeah that's that was pretty sweet last night i was kind of i was kind of happy uh that that uh that i learned that i found that from him and that he was there to help me figure it out and all we could uh we could crank out some selenium because you know it was looking like it was going to be an all-nighter just to find my find my selenium ah <laughs> lava lamps is lurking haha <laughs> nice nice go ahead and lurk away I'm so sure, Sword and Alex check. Remember when I started my PD save a while back? Well, I just got a full affin. I got full affinity with the Viking. Nice, nice, awesome, buddy. Heck yeah. Do you think you'll stream Ace Combat or just play it off stream? Be honest with you, Mike. I'm probably gonna just play it off stream, um, unless it's something really, really like. I, well, I'll be honest with you guys. I don't really stream anything right out the box. I've played quite a few games uh, this past several months. And I, honestly, I just, I play it and see if it's something I'll, I can do and stream at the same time. And with Ace Combat, I, I don't know. I think I will be ne neglecting the chat far too much with it. Just depending, you know, because I know uh, Ace Combat, uh, Oh, three, four, five um, are the ones I really got in depth in. Uh, three, four, and five. Uh, well, it was four and five and zero on on PlayStation Two. Um, you would go into like a oh goodness, fifteen, twenty minute combat session or sortie with your with your um, with your fighter, depending on you know how quickly you could take out the enemy fighter. So uh, it's kind of hard to say i don't know if i want to do that and not be able to keep up with the chat alexa make chat <laughs> nice yeah it's just uh i mean trust me i'm a huge fan of the of the uh, ace combat series i really am i i i, I have a six on playstation 3 was the only one i did not like And to be honest with you, I was, I was playing No Man's Sky at the time, so uh, it's kind of one of them things, because I didn't get it till after the fact, it's kind of one of them things that I probably wouldn't have, uh, I probably would have got into more if I'd have had less distracting games to play. But yeah, it was, I'm, I'm definitely looking for 7. That's, that's going to be a fun game. Mo most of the time I take a... Like Cobra always says, or been saying to people, you know, wait, watch before you buy. You know, wait, wait to get it. Let them update it a couple times, or do the day one patches or the hot fixes. Watch somebody stream it a little bit. Make sure it's content you're gonna want to play, and then go buy it. You know, especially if you're a if you're budget gaming where you can't really afford to buy a new game every week. And uh, you know, something like that, but. I, Ace Combat, I already know. You know, it, it, it's yeah. You know, I'm gonna play it regardless. If not, it'll be a it'll be a seventy eighty dollar paperweight. All right. Okay, cool. That's fair enough, dude. Last game I played were the Hawks games. Nice, nice, buddy. Heck yeah. All right, guys. We're we have been striking out pretty bad. I haven't even seen the A48 and 8 trolls yet. I I see, I I reloaded my save uh, probably six times before I started to stream in this station. So I've already seen one A48 and 8 troll, but you know, Ace Combat got good music, but I never played. It, it does have some good music, dude. Thanks. It's so funny. I thought I did it a while ago, but apparently not. Now I need to do missions and learn more words than them or <laughs> for them. <laughs> nice. Yeah. That's one thing about having multiple saves, buddy. <laughs> you about need a notebook to keep up with all the uh where you left off and what all you got what all you got accomplished. So I jumped on my um, I jumped on my second PSN legacy, and I haven't touched the zoology on it um, the entire time I played it. And I landed I 
jumped into a system this morning that had a it was an it had an exotic planet. So I went ahead and uh, got got my first first zoology milestone on that save. <laughs> I've been creating manual saves before leaving planet as hopeful gestures. Nice. Alright, let's see guys. What do we got? There's my first troll. Here we go guys. A48 and 8. Come on. Sean Murray, Sean Murray woke up from his slumber. Decided to hit the algorithm and start screwing with sword. So let's go ahead and uh, roll my save a little bit guys. And basically what I do there is uh, every now and again when you reload your save four, five, six times, something like that, um, go ahead and uh, jump in, create a new auto save, and it'll roll your save a little bit, guys. Sword in his cheat zoology. I know, buddy, I know. Hey, it's a it is a game mechanic. It's not a cheat. It's, it's, it's laid back, lazy zoology, and I like it. Be back later, about to eat some homemade chicken nachos. Nice, funny, have a great day and enjoy, dude. What is up, Pawn Stream? How are you doing, brother? It's not cheating, it's a feature. That's right, Matador. <laughs> exploit. It's not an exploit. Hey, if it was an exploit, I wouldn't be able to do it without doing something trickery to it. I, I upload that one life, I upload that one fauna just like y'all upload the 15 or 16. It ain't my fault you guys choose planets with 25 fauna to go find to upload. <laughs> oh. <laughs> with this smiley face. <laughs> Heck yeah. Come on. S class. <laughs> Heck yeah. Oh my goodness, guys. <laughs> the little winky smiley face. <laughs> Heck yeah, guys. Holy moly. C class look. Yeah, well, I'll be honest with you, though. I've, I learned uh, Sunday, you're probably going to see 20 C classes, a couple B classes, and a troll A class. And like I said, I rolled. My God, I rolled that save for. Um, I reloaded that save for I know at least three and a half hours solid just I had Zane's Zane stream up on the laptop and was listening to it and was just basically I was as soon as I seen what class it was reload the save and uh heck yeah man stick to dead planets <laughs> that's right some planets have eight some have 14 some have one just a matter of choice. That is right, buddy. Oh, my second troll, guys. Sweet. So now it's just 30 more C-classes and I'll have it. <laughs> but yeah, like I said, I'm more or less just trying to log some game time tonight anyway because... Uh, I think I got another couple hours of uh, gameplay time before I'll uh, crank out the uh, freighter launch or launch off into a freighter uh, battle, and I'm gonna try to try to save that and time it to where I can uh, portal back to my my jump off point and blast into that uh, that yellow S class or that yellow freighter. I'm up to 58, soon to be 59. Zoology, nice, John. That's good work, man. I mean, like I said, you guys, you guys like the zoology, man. It's that's a fun thing to do for y'all. I enjoy, I really enjoy scanning the zoology, but it's been my experience more often than not that last couple creatures are just far too hard that I want to put the effort into finding. Every time I see a class forty-eight, a class forty-eight, you have to do a loop-de-loop -loop around the planet. Then you get you grant guaranteed to ask like that. I hear you. John does real zoology. I hear you. All right, let's see what we got here, guys. C class, let's roll. All right, let's see. Next curious goal is an S class explorer. Nice, Meridius. There's some, there's some pretty nice explorers out there. 
I have yet to see one in my favorite body style in a yellow yet, but I know it's out there. We'll get it. I'm actually um, on which save was it? It may have been my new my new next save. I was looking for a um, it's a gray with the yellow highlights, like the one I have on most of my saves. The reward needs buffing. Then comes base building. I hear you, buddy. I was oh zoology yeah, and then base building is your second favorite. Cool, cool, man, cool. Heck yeah, guys. So what what all what all is? Let me rephrase. Let me back up the point here, guys. What are all of y'all currently doing in No Man's Sky? What projects you working on? What goals are you trying to accomplish? What ships are you trying to find? Guys, let me know. Let's get this chat a popping and uh, see what everybody's up to, guys. Because I guarantee you, not many of us are doing the same thing. Oh, let's see. I'll find you a yellow one in my galaxy. I hear you, Alexi. Maybe come to Galaxy 250 to come get you. <laughs> Which, honestly, uh, Alexi, check. I'm actually prepping a save currently. Um. I'm not planning on doing it probably till this summer. Um, I'm waiting until I get uh, until I get my computer built. Um, when I get it built and can start doing edited videos and stuff, I'm planning on uh, planning on doing the 255 Galaxy Trek. Um, but instead of streaming it live, cause it's gonna be a whole boatload of warping is I'm going to record footage as I'm playing and edit out like the warping and stuff like that. And if I find like cool planets, cool fauna, stuff like that, I'm going to edit it into like a 15, 20 minute video, uh, you know, and just start uploading those videos for each galaxy. Would be awesome to see that track. Heck yeah, I've been wanting to do it ever since you did it, dude. I really have. I just, uh, like I said, I, I prepped a, I prepped a save to do it. It's just like I said, I, I don't think it will be content to that will be, you know, very appealing to to people to hanging out in a stream. So you finish gathering twenty of each exotic biome trophy and place them at the dragon first. Nice, John. Heck yeah, dude. Let's see, KJ. I'm doing my first survival mode. My 150 hour normal save needs an S class fighter. My permadeath guy is establishing himself before he launches on the 249 more galaxies. Nice, KJ. Let's see, Pwn Stream. I'm looking, I'm looking for ships to add to my web page, like a little collection for me and others to get a hold on. Nice, buddy. Nice. Let's see, my oldest save is halfway through the fifth galaxy. Cool, cool. Let's see, John Hall's second goal is to build my first low orbit base on Reddit. Sweet, dude. Heck yeah, man. Oh man, yeah, a lot of work to edit. That. I know, I know. What? Well, that's kind of what I'm leaning on, cause uh, I have a little bit of free time on Saturday. So what I'll probably do is like Monday through Friday, cause like I normally stream on Wednesday, depending on my work schedule. I normally try to stream on Wednesday, but I don't get to. Sh I get to play a little bit, you know, Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday, or Thursday, but I don't really get time to stream on those days. Wednesday and Friday and Saturday is usually, and Sunday afternoon short one, is usually my stream times. So, if nothing goes wrong. But, that'll give me uh, a couple days to go do the trek through the galaxy, check out the systems. Because, I mean, with a 2800 light year warp drive, you can pr you pretty much get through a galaxy in, in eh, maybe four hours. If that. I mean, it depends on how much exploring you do. And then, you know, that, that'll that be something I can do and record, uh, you know, the three days I'm not streaming or four days I'm not streaming and then, uh, and then take like Saturday morning and edit it for two or three hours. Hopefully, that's all it's going to take. <laughs> Let's see. My oldest save is halfway through. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, let see. A lot of, okay. John's third goal is finish my base on Miranda. Cool, cool. I know. I got to get back to Miranda and do mine. Let's see, Matador, I'm currently searching for a new mega lush planet in red, green, and blue star systems, and hunting for a new freighter. Also still joining random games and giving new players help if I can. Cool, 
cool, Matador. Awesome of you to do that, dude. <coughs> I like reloading ship, ship honey. I do too, dude. <laughs> this is lazy hunting right here. Because I, I, like I said, I don't even play. I just boom, boom, boom. Let's get it done. Let's see. Get the S Class Explorer in the 64%. Or maybe a 63. <laughs> He's probably going to be a 63, dude. Oh, man. Let's see. Five more Diplos. Heck yeah, dude. <laughs> John, put post coordinates and take pitch. Nice. Otherwise, I'm building on my base. Cool, Pone Stream. Heck yeah, dude. Let's see. Find Raymer Sherbert 2.0. Cross fingers. Yeah, I know, buddy. I know. I'm, look I'm waiting on you to run across that, dude. Let's see. If I find a Diplo and Euclid, I'll grab the coordinates for you. Cool, cool. Thank you, KJ. Looking for a pretty planet with diplos to build a showcase base instead of a working base. Yeah, heck yeah, Henry. Let's see, Marius, leaving a base outpost on a nice planet if you don't mind this, if you don't mind a storm. <laughs> nice. What's going on, Sophie? How you doing? Heck yeah. Glad to have you. Thanks for coming by. Heck yeah, Maria still looking for Diplos to snuggle with. Nice. Let's see, dude, KJ, I found Diplos just the other night. Check out the screenshot section of Zane's Discord. I have some pics and also locations for others to see them too. Cool, cool. Heck yeah. Y'all guys are a uh, Diplo crazy. I know Alexichek, man, he was a, he's like a Diplo magnet. Let's see, they look like a big version of Game Mode's Diplos on... I, I see West Minor. Cool, cool. Diplo Hunters Union. Yeah, I know. So I posted the glyphs today, so yeah, check again. They weren't there yesterday when I posted the original pictures. Oh, okay, cool, cool. Nice, nice. I'm good. Thanks for the rage. Oh, anytime, sweetie. Anytime. I, I, I gotta get back in the habit of doing that, guys. I, I've been extremely lazy about that the last couple, well, last maybe three weeks I normally I'll try to see if anybody is up streaming when uh when I finish up and try to get y'all guys over and raid them a little bit but uh last uh that's probably the last few weeks I've just like as soon as I've said bye I was ready to go <laughs> or bedtime <laughs> but heck yeah heck yeah look like a, a very spooky game you was playing last night Loch Ness Diplos would be cool. Oh, man. How cool would it be to find underwater Diplos, guys? In the underwater biomes. Like a, fi like a, a fish Diplo. Yeah. Y'all speculate on that a little bit. <laughs> I don't even know how to rate. I, what you do, Lex, check is if you see somebody streaming uh, when you get finished up, you pop their link in the chat. And so that way everybody that's watching the stream and your side on your side can jump over to their stream and raid them but yeah I wish I had saved a location for the Cobra elephant Diplo but I had no idea what I was doing back then I was a noob noob then <laughs> I know what's up master Martin how are you buddy just like you I'm waiting on a s38 fighter mostly dark gray with light gray decals nice master Martin Heck yeah, and good luck, brother. Let's let's see who, let's see which one of us gets it first, Master Martin. <laughs> I'm trying to get this candy corn holler that's flying in. I got it on my um, on my new next save or my new uh, new save playthrough uh, that I've been playing on here lately. I picked it up Sunday during Zane's stream, but uh, I said I gotta have that ship. There's, there's a few ships in No Man's Sky I'll have on multiple saves. Let's see what do we got going on here. A forty seven? Nope. Let's roll. Alright, let's see. I found Cobra Diplos in the two hundred and fiftieth galaxy a couple days back. Nice, nice. Yeah, I know what you're talking about with them Cobra dip yeah, with the big cobra heads. Heck yeah, cool cool. I know like a plesiosaur. Cool cool. Floating diplos, there you go, Meridius. <laughs> No legs, only fins and neck. Heck yeah, man. Heck yeah. Dude, Thunder found a one point. Yeah, I seen yeah, I seen that, man. Heck yeah, congrats to Thunder for that. Especially on the vanilla 1.0. 
Yeah, Granny, it's a scary game. I managed to beat it in practice mode. Oh, cool, cool, cool. I'm going to go live again and try to beat it on easy mode. This time, Granny is home. I'm not looking forward to it. <laughs> nice. Granny kind of reminds me of RE, RE7. Look like fun. Cool, cool. Let's see. The rule is sword shows me a holler. I get it quickly before him. But if he knows... But if he shows me an explorer, he gets it multiple times before I get the one I'm after. <laughs> and he gets the one I showed him. <laughs> Heck yeah, man. Oh my goodness. I ship hunt just to mess with John. That secret's out, guys. I ship hunt just to mess, mess with John. I'll grab something really, 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 really good stats and I'll post pictures over in the Discord and like add him and tell him and, and, uh, and say, hey, dude, check out this cool ship. And, and it'd be the most difficult ship in the world. It might have took me three weeks of reloading to get it. And I tell him, yeah, I got this today. <laughs> oh, he does it to me too. <laughs> what is going on, bro pro gamers? How are you doing, man? Glad to have you. All right. <laughs> so once again, after you, after you'll be live, I will beat this game. Nice, nice. Good luck, sweetie. Good luck. I love it. It's great fun. I know, dude. I know. Heck yeah. Let's see. The rule is John must have six S Class 64% versions of that Explorer it, as his entire collection. I hear you. No, man. He. They ain't no way. Alexi, check. I don't believe it's. I don't believe it's technically possible in this game to get that ship in 64% six times. I and I'm not being joking about. It. I think I spent four days there reloading and 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 I didn't even reload as much as I do here like these I'm just popping reloads when I realize it ain't there I actually hung out and let the RNG play out after reloads and good grief getting that thing in a 64% was brutal I went back with another save to do it that following week and had to settle for a had to settle for a a, a 63 63% dude Go ahead, brother. Go ahead. Hey, we'll send you the coordinates, man. John's got it. He, he'll send you the coordinates. Trust me. <laughs> You'll find out the hard way, dude. After about three weeks, Alex checks it. We're going to ask Alex, check, hey, how many of them explorers do you got so far? And he's like, shut up, sword. <laughs> Let's see. My extreme survival finally started going more than 32 souls. I know, man. I know. I think... Uh, I think the, the the save that the second time I went and got it, I was at 72, 73 on that account when I finally got the seat. When I finally settled for the 63, dude. I can't even reload when I, oh crap! You can't reload in Euclid. That sucks, dude. See what? Well, you got a new save in Euclid, don't you? Heck yeah. I see. I need three max slot hollers then one fighter explore an exotic cool cool dude heck yeah i love lexi's rules <laughs> i know oh no oh man <laughs> hey sophie how are you it was funny watching you play granny awesome awesome can't even really oh cool cool here's swords black and red explorer location there you go bird sunset bird boat sunset bird black hole scarab bird bird faces boat <laughs> oh my did someone need that or was that a, was it a different ship yo i just got a scanner module of nine 9,975 percent fauna bonus and 8107 floor dude sweet sweet load man that was pretty good I don't think I, I don't think I've got any of that high I, well yeah that's that's freaking high for for flora man or for fauna hey blood raven I'm good thanks man I managed to beat it on practice mobile granny was at home it's going live again later to beat it on easy mode when Granny is home. Cool, cool, cool. I know, damn. <laughs> that was a. Now, now you just need three more like that, dude, and you'll be getting like six hundred thousand every time you get a rare one. <laughs> oh my, nice man, nice. 
All right, guys. Heck yeah. That is not a bad scanner module at all, dude. Gotta check that address. MPC permanent. Nice, nice. Ah. I'll have, yeah. I'm pretty sure I got the, the uh, portal address saved as a, like the portal address type, you know, for at, at the portal. A uh, screenshot of that I can uh, drop in the Discord, but cool. There's my other troll ship. That's three troll ships now, guys. All right, so let's go ahead and roll my save real quick. Makes four for the night, three for the stream, guys. What's going on, Pasha? How you doing? Welcome back. Glad to see you, dude, and thank you for the sub yesterday. Much, much, much appreciated. See, I'm still working on mine. Need a couple more. Like the one you got, funny. It's nice. I'll roll a save, and the next one will be 6,000 for both. I know, I know, man. Like I said, man, rolling that tech out is brutal, man. Because, like, yeah. you Like, with the hyperdrives, I've seen... I've, I think I've seen one 250 in all my saves. And it took... Man, 10 or 12 you 10 or 12 uh, S-Class upgrades to get that thing at the, at the 250 uh, light year range. Oh, by the way, that's a double. Yeah, guys. No, you permadeath guys going for that uh, red and black explorer, be very, very cautious. It is an extreme sentinel and extreme toxic planet, guys. So make sure make sure your toxic protection is charged up before you go through the portal because uh, it'll drop you in, a, in like 10 seconds. It is nasty extreme. But then again, you clock your uh, extreme survival time. You clock your stream, extreme survival time twice as fast there. So I say settle for the 48. No, ain't no way, dude. Never happened. Oh, cool, cool. Awesome, Matador. Thank you for subbing. Heck, yeah. What is going on, Chris? Christopher LeBlanc? Never settle for second best. You got that right. So, oh, my God. I rolled my hyperdrives. Probably 50 of them. And they are all 250 and 249. I think it has 250. I think it has two 250s. And other other four are 249. I was tired, tired. Oh, trust me. I know. It is brutal. Scanners roll fast. There you go. I'm getting a lot of A37s. It's a wealthy system too. Cool, man. Cool. Yeah. The only I tell you what makes a the S-class ship hunting a lot harder since next is that now there are systems that have um, multiple of the heavy fighters, like the white fighter that I got on my main save, uh, my Excalibur ship. It has uh, three 38 and eight or 38 and 12 fighters that land at those trade posts so rolling i mean i i think out of every 10 reloads that white fighter will come in four times what's the most people you had in the stream i have seen uh i believe it was up um uh, i think i had one stream that was over 30 at one time very briefly very briefly over 30 But heck yeah y'all can hear me pouring my drink can't you yeah i'm cheating i stepped away from the stepped away from the game a second <laughs> that's that's the lovely thing about not running the camera and having a bluetooth headset <laughs> let's see yeah 30 uh let's check that's about as many as i've seen uh pop in at one time kind of like a third i think it was 30 or 35 so like it would it wasn't above 40 by no means but yeah i was a. Uh, I started getting a little nervous <laughs> all right let's see what we got going on here guys kj sebmeyer's reload my freighter battle yesterday no s class oh yeah brutal lava man i think after next launch there were some streams that were were like 30 yeah i mean like i said i i get i get 
you know, it surges from time to time. What is up, Snarf a lot? Hi, hi, what's you hunting today? I'm hunting my candy corn uh, ball hauler today, Snarf a lot. The one I found the other night on my other save. It's a yellow and orange ball hauler. Let's see, I've seen 40 watching sword stream. Nice, heck yeah, dude. Um, do you want the cords to it, Snarf a lot? You can check it out later. And for any of y'all guys that are interested, I got, uh, I actually have a, the cords already in the Discord under the screenshots. But yes, yeah, Snarf, if you want me to, if you want me to drop it uh, to you on a DM on Twitter, I can do that as well. Let's see, if someone is looking for ships, there's a link on my YouTube page to my ship site called Stone. It's for PC players. I just started it up. There's not much ship. Okay, cool, cool, man. Heck yeah. B class. Let's roll. Well, let me let me show Snarf a lot this ship real quick. Check this thing out, dude. I like this thing. It is bright, man. You pop into this, and and all the all the pirates cover their face because this this thing's so bright. <laughs> Let's see. Cool, cool. I take a look after sword strings. Cool, cool. Awesome. We'll definitely, definitely have to check it out, pawn string. Heck yeah. I decided to quit looking for ships and go back to making money. Even a B class of what I wanted is thirty million, so I'm. On a salvage scrap planet, haven't found a single down south. Ah, oh, brutal, brutal. See, snarf lock, your name reminds me. See, did I reload already? No, I didn't. Let's reload. Um, snarf lock, your name reminds me of the snarf character, snarf character from Thundercats. Thundercats, who? <laughs> oh, man. My name shows my age a bit. I <laughs> uh, know, man. I tell you, I, I said something the other day, was talking about a TV show, and I'm like, oh, man, I just dated myself. <laughs> oh, my. Let's uh, see. I couldn't be creative, hence my username. I hear you, buddy. I hear you. <laughs> I tell you what, guys. It's very, very few games that I had. Well, no, I think there's no games. I probably... I probably had the sword gamer tag for, oh my God, forever. Ever since I got into it. All right, B class, crud. Come on, guys. Come on, Sean Murray. Sling out the S class. Go ahead and flip the button for S class drops. Lava is the only. It's the only here, only one here older than me. <laughs> Let's see. My PSN username is is a play on the Sesame Street character Snuffleupagus. <laughs> nice. Snuffleupagus, Chris. <laughs> nice, Chris. Uh, heck yeah. You know, Big Bird's Holy Mammoth's friend. Ah, oh, cool. Yeah, I do remember that, man. Good God. It's been a while since I watched Sesame Street. PS4 wanted a username. I could not think of anything, but was looking at my lava lamp, so I thought, that, thought why not? <laughs> nice. What is going on, Dark Lord Zelric? I had Zelric since the 2000, since 2002-ish. Nice, dude. <clears throat> Heck yeah, dude. Welcome, man. Glad to have you. Heck yeah. See, I got... Oh, man, C-Class. Let's see. Now who's showing their age? <laughs> oh, uh... <laughs> Winchester says, I think I'm the only teen here. <laughs> I think uh, Remus was in earlier. I don't know if he's still lurking about or not, but Remus may have you beat Sophie. You and him, you and him's about the same age. <clears throat> Let's see. I've had KJ Hamnick since 
Um, not two six. <laughs> nice. Let's see. I grew up on that 7080 Sesame Street. Nice. Awesome, Chris. Oh, my. I can't even remember what, what cartoons I was. I can love watching. I remember uh, the, the original Transformers would come on in the afternoons. I'd catch that when I got home from school. Yep. I've had my real name since 1964. Nice. Started Master Martin in 1992. Dang. Let's see. A48 Nate. Come on with the troll ships. <laughs> Fraggle Rock, anyway. Oh, brutal, man. I remember, uh, what was that one? Um, I can't remember the name of it, but it was a, it was a, it was a dinosaurs. But it was like, uh, like the Flint, kind of like a family, like the Flintstones or something. It was funny. Hell yeah, Fraggle Rock. <laughs> <laughs> nice, Snarfalot. <laughs> Looking at that date, I feel so old. I hear you, man. Don't feel old, man. You're young as you feel. I grew up watching Don Adams and Inspector Gadget. Nice, nice. 1983 Inspector Gadget. Yes, awesome. Yeah. <laughs> See, I always, uh, when I was younger, uh, me and my me and my grandmother was really, really close. She was a very, very sweet old lady. And what she would do is, um, I was the only kid uh, in in the in the neighborhood. Well, I wouldn't say neighborhood in the holler because I grew up in the country, guys. Uh, but I was the only kid around that that liked the. Um, what was it? It was a uh, uh, black licorice candy. It was like the hard candy, and my grandmother would buy it every every week. She would buy a box, and and when I get home from school, I go home, get my homework done, change into some uh, go out and get dirty clothes or my outside. I call, they called it out out play clothes because I'd tear them up so much, but change into my outside play clothes, and I'd go down to my grandmother's house and and. Me and her would eat a piece of that candy, and uh, we'd watch. Uh, she would watch Matt Lock and In the Heat of the Night. <laughs> but yeah, I definitely it's good times, guys. Well, wow, Lava, when you were born, mankind hadn't even walked on the moon yet. Oh, brutal acro year! You didn't have to go there, dude. Come on. <laughs> okay, so next time you're on the FDI Amino, you'll see a cool ship. It's really fast. Uh oh. What you got, man? What you got? Oh, on the Amino. Okay, cool, cool. I'll tell you what, let me pop over there real, real quick and see what's going on with it. I saw the moon landing live. My father woke the kids to watch it. Cool. Good class. Oh, no, he didn't. He posted up the Baltastic to rub it in. Let's see. Cool, cool. Looks like you miss an emerald for your uh, indium drive. That's an interesting, uh, interesting uh, cyclotron layout on it, though, dude. All right. Let's catch the chat up now, guys. Let's see. Oh man, I remember my grandmother. She loved wrestling. Couldn't tell her it was fake or for Jack. <laughs> oh, let's see. My brother woke us up in the middle of the night to watch. Cool, cool. That is very awesome, Lava. They should have some dude, double S class ships for us more than hardcore. I know, man. It. I'm telling you, man. Since next S classes have been become like extremely rough to find you gotta have some commitment to pull an s class or a, a specific s class let me let me back up and punt because i've run across s classes a lot but a specific 
large S class that I'm actually wanting and looking for, yeah, they have been few and far between here lately. It's at least I, it's the least I can do. Cause <laughs> thank you, dude. Let's see. Also, get smart. Hogan's Heroes, Dukes of Hazard, Knight Rider, MacGyver, Jerry Lewis, Jack and the Fat Man, Scarecrow, and Mrs. King. Six million dollar man and Starsky and Hutch. I hear you, buddy. That's an accuracy build per Zane's Mega Shield. Okay, cool, cool. I thought you would get more by t uh, by um, putting your Cyclotron um, S classes in an L shape and having them touch the main. But one, two, three, Kane. What system is this? Um, well, it's just the uh, one I discovered. Oh, what galaxy? It's Euclid. I'm a uh, Euclid on PS4 in normal. And I tell you what, guys, if y'all are interested in coming and finding this ship uh, after the stream or later on, um, if if you check in the description below to the Noob Nation Nexus Discord link, uh, I actually have this posted up. It's a few days ago in the uh, in the uh, screenshots channel. Let's see, who remembers Batfink? I do not, buddy. Let's see, could have done a couple tweaks to it, but yeah, it looks a little weird. Yeah, well, I like it, though. I think it was pretty pretty clean layout, man. Let's see, the damage potential is less, but accuracy and damage per shot is great. If you roll out those uh, Cyclotron upgrades and get a higher, um, um, what is it called? Uh, I'm going to tell you real quick. Let me look. Uh, if you roll out those uh, those cyclotron upgrades and get a higher fire rate, I think they'll go to 15, if I'm not mistaken. Um, they'll go to plus 15% on the cyclotron. And if you get, uh, mo you see right there is a 14. Like it, a normal uh, roll on them will get you a really good one. It's 13, 14, or 15, and if you get uh, all of them up to like 13, 14, or 15, it'll actually give you quite a bit more damage potential uh, with the uh, with the Cyclotron equipped. Let's see. Just found an S-Class in the Anomaly Cabinet 10 slot. Nice lava lamps. So well, that's my S-Class. All 57 million. Nice, Master Martin. Good job, dude. And, and man, that was good luck, man. How long, how long was you hunting that ship today before I got started streaming? Or did you start about the same time? And now now I'm just jealous. <laughs> Who remembers the old British show called Daz Army? I do not. Rate of fire, yeah. Heck yeah, man. I remember watching Black Adder, Monty Python, and Mr. Bean. Oh, man, Chris, I love Mr. Bean. I like the movies. I didn't watch Life. He had a show. I didn't know it, but yeah. No, he did have a show. I remember that little three-wheel blue car you used to drive around. It would always tip over. <laughs> Stupid boy. <laughs> oh, man. About the same time. Dang, Master Martin. Good job, dude. That is very fortuitous. My goodness. It's days like this, I kind of wish I up, would go ahead and upgrade my PS4 to that 2 terabyte SSD, but... <laughs> it's like right here where you got this load screen that takes about uh, 52 to 56 seconds to load into the save. It cuts it down to like 36 to 38 seconds. So when you're doing like 100 reloads, it saves you a lot of time later, in, later on. Let's see. I remember watching Benny Hill. Benny Hill. Cool, cool, cool. Black Adder was the best. <laughs> nice. <laughs> so it was it was revived the newt. Nice. Let's see, Doctor Who. That Benny Hill waltz in my playlist. Normal speed though. Oh, cool, cool. Doctor Who, the theme song is awesome enough to bring back so many memories. Cool, cool. Row, row, row your boat. Oh Lord, PCM.2 drive look. Yeah, that's right. You got the P. You on PC? Heck yeah, man. 
definitely I'm looking into I'm looking into doing the M.2 drive uh, on this new build I'm or on the build I'm planning on I just gotta every every time I every time I see something cooler I add to my list it, it bumps my it bumps my budget up and I'm I stay I, I've all I've every time I reach my budget I always add like four hundred dollars more stuff I want to it so yeah eventually I'm gonna have a like a freaking war game supercomputer in my living room <laughs> I'm assuming all you old folks remember X-Files otherwise I'm gonna be disappointed <laughs> nice let's see Zerk are you familiar with the bug that makes the space station first wave non-static no Zelrick or no he's the bug magnet Hey, okay, something has changed. I guess got the Atlas V1 on my second visit to the anomaly. It's always been the third. Hmm. Unless you forgot about the first visit, KJ. Scolder. Scully and Mulder. Those two getting some creepy things. I hear you. Heck yeah. Nice. Let's see. And that's one of his uh, favorite shows, said John Hall. I'd honestly rather be corrected than make the same mistake again. Let's see, I watched Battlestar Galactica when I was 11. Uh, here's a fun fact, the 90s crew from the X-File worked on the first five seasons. Oh, cool, cool. Nice, I did not know that. Come on, B-Class, really? Quit trolling me. <laughs> Xena Warrior Princess. <laughs> I remember Hercules and Xena. Heck yeah. I watched them. <laughs> Old Kevin Sorbo. And freaking Lucy Lawless. <laughs> now, let's see. The first wave, or the first visit, I already had the task done, and this time I already had the task done, so maybe. Hmm. Cool, cool. If you hop in the ship before before the ships pop in, I guess. Huh, okay. Cool, cool. Who remembers the A Team? I remember the A Team. Hannibal Face, BA, and, uh, and, uh, crap. Murdoch. There you go. I pity the fool who don't. <laughs> oh, heck yeah. Stingray in Space 1999. Hmm. Let's see. X-Files. I saw one of the re revival episodes when it says a man who turns into a lizard and he goes the lizard who turns into a man. And she's like, what's the difference? <laughs> Ah, snakes on a plane. Oh, no, no, no. That was a... Who was that? B.A. ain't getting on no plane. <laughs> I remember that. You used to have to knock him out to fly him anywhere. <laughs> Heck yeah, Quantum Leap. I did like Scott Bakula and that. I liked him. I think he done an awesome job on the Enterprise. I think um, he shined pretty good on that one. I can't... I, it sucked it only run of, what, four seasons? Yeah. Yep, Quantum Leap 2. These shows came out when I was older, though. Yeah. I tell you, man. How many of y'all guys watch Babylon 5? It's going to go dead silence. I'm probably going to lose about six subs for saying that. But, yeah, I'm a Babylon 5 fan. <laughs> Heck, yeah, Enterprise was awesome, Matador. I, I thoroughly enjoyed it, but I'm telling you, though, uh, that Jolene Blaylock that played uh, uh, to Paul, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, what you doing, sucker? This road leads directly to the airport, Hannibal. This road's nowhere near the airport. Please fly over here. <laughs> cool, cool. So we do got a couple B5 fans. Heck yeah. A48 and 8, man. That's a troll ship number 5 tonight, guys. Heck yeah. Too hot to be a Vulcan. I'm telling you, man. <laughs> it, it, yeah, definitely, definitely. Let's see. Also in a weird, funny room. The show Fringe was one of my favorite. I did. I I watched Fringe. I think the first season, first first or first and second season, I believe. 
I know I watched the first one like religiously. I but they moved it to a different day or something. I think it used to come on Thursday nights. And when they moved it to another day, I, I, my work schedule, I couldn't get home to watch it. And, or they had something else coming on. So, yeah, I, I, did, I lost track of it. I remember that show, that and the show uh, Heroes. I really enjoyed. Let's see. Who remembers UFO? I do not remember UFO lava lamps. Let's see, we gotta bring down the firewood lurking in the shadows, sir. Don't be scared. Babylon 5, I found the dialogue to be bombastic. But I got it on DVD it was 847. Uh, I got it on DVD and later was able to appreciate it better. I'm gonna tell you, Babylon 5 was one of them things that you had to bear with the storyline through the first two seasons. And because the way and it's, the reason it's one of my favorite shows was because the story arc, like some of these, like some of these shows have like a story arc that lasts a season and then they move on to another story arc. But Babylon Five, the story arc lasted the first four seasons, and then Five, the fifth season was kind of tied up a loose end season. And man, definitely, definitely one of my favorite shows. Um, yeah, definitely. Uh, it, I mean, that was probably probably one of the first shows that really stirred me up when it ended. Uh, only show I barely remember was Sliders High. Man, I, I remember Sliders. Let's uh, see, Starzinger. I don't remember that one, Pony String. Also loved the original Hawaii Five-O. Heck yeah. What is going on, MT Colon Forge? How you doing, buddy? Glad to have you, and good to see you. Let's see, A46. We're getting, we're getting a lot more A's in, guys. It may, it may slip up and screw up and let me have an S class here in a minute. Sliders was for stoners, and yes, I watched it. <laughs> that explains my attraction to it, possibly. <laughs> Heck yeah, man! Glad you're doing good, MT. Oh yeah, we just uh. We just scuffing saves tonight and uh, trying to trying to trying to squeak out a S class uh, of this this orange and yellow candy corn holler. I am. It, it is a a very fine and space worthy ship. KJ, I love sliders. Nice, nice. But yeah, man. Definitely, definitely like some B5. Oh, cry like a man. It's also on playlist. Nice. Oh, <laughs> uh, let's see. What else was there? That was quite. That was a bunch of shows in the 80s. 80s and 90s. It was pretty good. All right. What do we got? S class? No. Ah, oh, brutal. Let's see, does so anyone have a recent bug that makes you recharge your portals each time you boot up the game? I can still use them. I'm no I'm not locked out or anything, but I have to change the glyphs reg charge the glyphs reg Oh man, really John? That sucks, dude. It sucks and it's kinda lucky because like I said, when that happened to me on my legacy, yeah, you couldn't use the dang things because you couldn't charge them. But yeah, ooh, brutal dude. I like how in season one of Supernatural Deans, like I don't know, man, demons, and this big, even, this big even for us, season nine, waiting at a bus stop with the King of Hell. He's a demon. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Let's see, S class, please show me. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, John Hall, John Hall done that to me when I done when I got uh, my Warhammer baller, and uh, sure enough, it showed up the next that that, that wave. So. Yeah, man, I haven't I haven't had that problem since uh since the TOG uh since the TOG uh gas harvester bases. I think the portal thing happens uh, when you join other people's games and then go back solo. That's what happened to me. Hmm. You think that might be what it is, John? 
where you join in game, join in lobbies and coming back. Let's see, I graduated high school in 1983, so when I say I was older for these shows, I was. <laughs> That's weird because I can return to a portal that is open from its last use, and I can use it, but I have to charge the glyphs for each portal per game session. Dang, man. When I was little, I watched Star Trek, and when we go outside, we play Star Trek. Nice, nice. If it happened to me too, John. I have a base built beside it, and it deactivates a lot. Ooh, dang, snarf a lot. That is a little brutal, man. Y'all need, y'all might need to put that in uh, to the Zen desk. Give him a heads up on that. Let's see, I play almost, I play offline almost all the time. I rarely play multiplayer. Yeah. What is going on, Mario? How are you doing, buddy? Glad to see you. Oh man, in a B class. Ugh. I don't even know if there was an S class. Been in for years since I played. What? Oh God. Yeah, you gotta get back in it, Kane. I'm telling you, man, this game has come a long way in a year. We have a uh, quite a bit of a uh, new content. Good, my friend. You. Oh man, I am. I am awesome, dude. Hanging out with all you cool people in the chat and uh, reloading the saves, crossing my fingers and toes, waiting on this S class to pop in. Hanging, hanging on to the hope that the next wave is going to have an S class. I reported a few, a few different bugs today. I made some suggestions too. <laughs> I hear you, man. Gotta go. See you next time. Talk Ta ta for now. All right, Master Martin, dude. Very, very glad to have you, and uh, much appreciate you hanging out with me, buddy. Definitely, definitely. We'll see you next time, dude. Heck yeah. Let's see. I'll be honest with you. I will probably, if nothing's going on at the house tomorrow, and my wife doesn't decide to, uh, we got to do something family ways uh, tomorrow afternoon. <laughs> I should be live um, shortly after Zane's stream tomorrow. Uh, and hopefully I'll be tricking out this new S-Class uh, holler, man. Really? Let me refresh. Holy cow, dude! Ho, 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 ho! Heck yeah, Matador! Thank you for letting me know that. Man, good grief, guys. I am I am at the cusp of hitting the big 500 guys. Heck yeah. Let's see. Looking for a specific ship. Yeah, I'm looking for a Let's see where's that? Here it is. I'm looking for this orange and yellow holler. It's the first wave into the station of Mario. I picked it up the other night on one of my other saves on my new uh my new save playthrough. And I I done a little um uh, I done a little uh, creative playing with my two different PlayStation accounts and my two Playstations and actually got one of my other saves in the same region. Cause really I'm trying to get in a uh, I'm doing this to kind of log some time in so that way I can uh I can uh go into a freighter battle with this save because I'm I'm gonna pick up that yellow um, that yellow. Um, uh, Star Destroyer that I got the other night. I once put in five separate, bu separate bug reports in one day. <laughs> nice, Lava. I mean, well, honestly, guys, that's the way to do it because if you put these bug reports in and they see the same bug reports coming in from different people, don't think that somebody else has done it and, and not do it. Do it, guys, because, like I said, it, you know, if, if you know, two or three hundred people start putting in the bug report for the same issue, they're going to put more uh, more of their assets towards getting that bug fixed, guys. Let's see, when we get to ship and space overhaul, how cool would it be if there was a higher and rarer class of ships above S and maybe more ships per system and exotic subtypes? Yeah, man, definitely. That That's on my wish list is a, is a medium and heavy uh, exotics. Hey, all, besides the efficient thrusters upgrades, are there thruster upgrades for the ships? I can't remember. No, efficient thrusters is the only upgrade. It's a blueprint upgrade for your uh, thruster, and it just cuts your usage of uh, fuel in half. For like, um, 
exotics and explorers you get eight launches per uh, refill with the efficient thrusters and it's four without them and then for like haulers fighters and a and a i don't know i think shuttles are efficient as well i think they get four um but yeah like the the haulers the fighters and the um i believe that's it they get a they get a two and then four with the efficient Yep, it's only one cool, cool. No, not really. Some people had the photonic score, which is the A class. Did it survive the uh, the the next? What's going on, Dark Lord? Uh, the long. As long as they don't steal my pirate ships, I hear you. I hear you, Mr. Nova. <laughs> All right, reload to save, guys. Cool, cool. All right, let's see. I love to see alien freighters. My dream is a Voltron fighter. Ah, oh, nice. I am the warden. <laughs> nice, buddy. Heck yeah, explorers get, I think, eight in stock form, ten with the fish. No, I think it's four, and then it goes to eight, John. I'm not going to swear to it, but I'm pretty sure. I, to, and, and the reason I don't know is because that's usually one of the first things I put on a ship. I, that, yeah. That's, that's probably one of the first upgrades I, I do to a ship, and usually before I ever leave the space station with it or the trade post with it let's see on the one of my saves i've ripped out my efficient thrusters and rebuilt them three times my ship can't lift off with only 20 percent fuel ah brutal cool cool what is going on panda say what oh say man what's happening <laughs> he's typing drunk i guess <laughs> What is going on, Panda? How are you doing good, sir? Glad to have you. Man, Panda. Oh, Panda, you lucky devil. Check it out, guys. Panda pops in. I get the freaking S-Class. <laughs> so weak. Oh, man, 55% shields. Are you kidding me? You know what? I'm taking it anyway, but still, I'm. I, listen, I'll buy you, but I am not pleased, sir. <laughs> oh, nice, nice, nice. <clears throat> Heck yeah, got my candy corn holler. We're going to buy this thing straight out, guys. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. <laughs> Working and lurking, I hear you. Oh man, let me catch this thing up, man. Let me catch this thing up. Y'all guys done got, y'all went to popping as soon as I got that freighter. I see a large capital ship version two, maybe much more expen expensive than the current S class and 48 slots. Hmm, that is not a bad, bad wish list item there, John. What is that, Penne? <laughs> Let's see, first blueprint I get is the comic scanner. Ah, the comic scanner, yeah, definitely, definitely. Hello everyone, working and lurking. Glad to have you. Much appreciated to lurk. Heck yeah, hashtag panda poopy. Woo woo. Heck yeah, guys. Nice, nice, nice. <laughs> Reload. <laughs> uh, I was gonna say you better buy that shit, man. Yeah, you know me. I'm gonna get. I, I'm, I'm getting to the point now. I turned down S classes because of the stats and the layout, but. Yeah, hollers. I mean, honestly, hollers. It, it, yeah, it's not that big a deal to me on the hollers as far as the as far as the shield up, you know, the shield bonus. I mean, now if it was like a freaking fifty, yeah, I'd, I'd wait for something better. But heck yeah, now stick around because the S you want will be right behind it. I know, I know. Better call that thing Cornelius. <laughs> oh man. I need something expensive to buy. Being their problems, I hear you. I hear you. Heck yeah, guys! All right, so we have picked up the holler, guys. Let's take this puppy for a test drive. What is her name? She is called Raging Setouch X or Ten. Heck yeah! Heck yeah! All right, let's go ahead and start busting tech down, guys. Start getting the sword layout set up. 
Let's see, what do I need for? I think I need a cobalt mirror. No, I need a dihydrogen jelly. Cool, cool. Do I have the hydrogen? That's the better question. Do I even have the hydrogen jelly blueprint? I do. And I don't have enough to hydrogen. Okay, let's talk to one of these ships and grab some. Heck yeah. Made the day, guys. Made the day right there. Cornelius. <laughs> I like that. Oh, brutal. You ain't gonna have none either. Crud. Alright, let's see. Now you got nothing else I need. Oh, here you go, Panda. There's my, there's the Nemesis ship that I sent you coordinates on. Oh, let's see. Lando. <laughs> Raging the touch, nice. All right, all right, Winchester, or, or I mean Sophie, have a great night, sweetie. Heck yeah, we'll, we'll check you out when I get done if I can. Oh, heck yeah, man. Why? Well, I, I sent you. A, I I DM'd you the coordinates. I think on a on a Amino, if I'm not mistaken, the the graphic that had the the uh, portal coordinates for it. You can go, but never leave. <laughs> Let's see what do we got here. Heck yeah, guys! And Panda, dude, Matador just brought it up a few minutes ago, man. I am like almost at 500 dude I am like tripping on that guys definitely definitely awesome alright he's going to have the same inventory let's see is there anything over here hiding let's go up to the trait the galactic trait terminal here 490 freaking 9 guys heck yeah all right, come on. You got the hydrogen jelly in here somewhere, guys. Let's go ahead and buy the cobalt mirror. Let's see what else. Let's go on to the other side and try over there. Heck yeah, guys. I'm telling you, dude. Uh, <laughs> heck no. She'll never co-host, dude. She, she'll come through the house, seriously. She'll walk past me while I'm streaming. And she'll get quiet. She ain't ever that quiet. I, it, you know, <laughs> now you know why I stream so much. <laughs> but yeah. Oh, heck yeah, man. Oh, watch this. You get a Celebrity S-Class Yellow Freighter once you hit five. I'm telling you, man. I got the I got the Celebrity Yellow S-Class Freighter picked out, man. I just got to get, I just got to get on the, uh, there we go. I just got to have the, uh, the uh for it to spawn in uh or the battle to spawn all right let's see we're going to do the uh we need sodium nitrate for the ablative armor heck yeah heck yeah guys very i've been looking at it all week and i'm like you know it ha honestly until matador said something about it it hadn't really i hadn't really give it too much thought you know i'm like yeah i'm in the 490s that's all right I'll hit 500 soon. I ain't really, really got too excited about her. You know, I am, but, uh, you know, it, I'm trying not to get too excited about it. And then and Matador brings it up. And I'm like, yay! <laughs> Giddy as a kid. I love that candy corn color. Heck yeah, man. Behind every great interloper is a great woman. You got that right, buddy. Heck yeah. All right, now. We gotta find some sodium nitrate. I think one of these uh, NPCs will have it. Bad thing is, I probably got a ton of it stashed somewhere in some ship, but I'm too lazy to look. Which actually, no, that was actually my third ship on this uh, on this save. Well, not my third ship, but the the that's the third out of the three, I, or the last one out of the three I got. Uh, still having still have let's see Doo -doo -doo -doo. Huh. let's see we don't need salt refractor or copper okay well holy moly I guess I'm about to go hunt I'm kind of curious how far away I went through the portal so I can't do it anyway 
heck yeah, man. Definitely happy to have it. Let's see, 490 light years away from home. I wonder what I will find in between. Nice. Alright, so there's not going to be no sodium nitrate here, so let's go on. i tell you what, let's check the ship, because I know, I know, I know, I know, I rarely, rarely ever not have a, have a, my ship stocked up with sodium nitrate. Holy moly, I don't have it stocked up with sodium nitrate. What a, what a ripoff. I usually keep a thousand sodium nitrate and, uh, titan or, uh, tritium and, uh, Uranium, uh, yeah, uranium for launch thruster, yeah. Let's see what we got. Save so nitrate. <gasps> nice, thank you, sir. I'll buy a grand of that. Oh my goodness, guys. The candy corn is mine. Oh, I believe that is the wife home. Give me just a second, guys. Hi. hi. Say hi to the chat. One, one of the guys in the stream wanted to know if he's going to co-host a co-host a uh, stream with me when I hit 500 subs. I will. You will? I will. I know you will. I'm talking I about will. talking about Mrs. Sword. <laughs> All right. Little Sword said he would. <laughs> let's see cool 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 all right chat is caught up and i just bought that didn't i i think man eh, i'm about 2000 all right let's see what we got going on here guys oh i'm in the wrong ship now dang it <laughs> hashtag miss the sword what did i Oh, John didn't got. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's see what we got going here, guys. Let's get my blade of armor done. All right. So we got that done. Let's see what we got coming on here. All right. So we're gonna do hyperdrive that way, pulse engine down that way, shields that way. So that will leave me. I need to do my indium drive there. So we're gonna put the economy scanner here and that's where my conflict scanner will go and then my teleporter will go right here teleporter there all right so that'll block that'll block all this off down here and then these five slots I'll do my um, my uh, cyclotron all right so I need dockside and they sold that up that other at the other uh, terminal up here with a healthy amount of dockside. What? Me? Gonna fly away when I jump to him. Heck yeah! What? I think I just got it, guys. Heck yeah! Frank the Bunny. Thank you, dude. Frank the Bunny was subscriber number 500, guys. <laughs> Heck yeah, guys. Freaking sweet. <laughs> thank you guys thank you thank you thank you you guys just do not know how much I appreciate the support y'all guys give this channel heck yeah hashtag Frank the bunny all right let's see what we got going yeah I just got the notification popped up on my laptop <laughs> freaking sweet baby there he is. <laughs> Thank you, buddy. Thank you. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Donnie Darko. <laughs> oh, let's see. Cool, cool, cool. Woohoo, sore. Congratulations. Thank you, guys. Definitely, definitely, definitely greatly appreciated. Oh, my goodness, guys. Man, awesome. What do we got going on here? Let's get this ship built real quick. 
What am I doing? What am I doing? Okay. Oh. Uh, cyclotron. Then I need to do my... Um, I need to do my... Uh, Dyson pump. Alright, so we're going to need... We're going to need Emerald. We're going to need Tetra Cobalt. We're going to need a Walker Brain. And then we're going to start picking S Class uh, modules up. Cool, cool. Heck yeah, guys. I don't even know what to say about that. Just thank you, thank you. And all of that didn't take long. Guys, I'm telling you. I just, uh. Oh man, I try not to get excited. <laughs> I really am, guys, because, uh, like I said, it, uh, yeah, <laughs> it is, uh, heck yeah, guys, sweet, definitely appreciated. Heck yeah, heck yeah. All right, so we're going, we're going to go ahead and take my nemesis back. Let's go ahead and get this thing renamed, guys. Let's go ahead and get this thing renamed. Put it back. Change this thing back to nemesis. Thank you, Acro. You're definitely appreciated. Call it Mint 500 and order 500 stuff. So I hear you. I'll tell you what. Let's do a... Oh, man. What do I need to call this thing? I think I think Panda's going to... I think Panda's got it. I think Panda's got it. We're going to have to call it Cornelius 500. How about that? <laughs> I was still laughing about that. That was funny. Oh, man. Oh. Uh. right buttons here guys let's see how in the heck did he spell that I'm going to roll this chat back and find out oh my goodness gracious oh my okay There we go. Done and done. Now let's get the chat scroll back down. Catch up on it. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, uh, just landed on a planet on my norm on my new normal mode game. Green grass, blue water, and sky. Base is going down. Nice lava. Heck yeah, buddy. Best name ever. <laughs> I know, man. Tanning Chatham. Or Tanning Chatham. <laughs> Sexy boy. <laughs> Thank you. Heck yeah, sweet ship dude. Next time we play we'll have to have a have to have a car show. I know dude, I know. I like my collectibles, man. I like my collectibles. Alright, let's see. Make sure there ain't no other another another S class hauler flying here while I've been goofing around. Alright, let's get back at Nemesis and get back to the portal guys. It is time. It is time. We're gonna go see we're gonna see where we're at as far as uh we need to warp around and grab some tech anyway. So what I'm gonna do, because I'm gonna be going to a, uh, I'll actually be jumping into systems and going into the space station and creating saves anyway. So when I do pop into a, uh, when I do pop into a freighter battle, what I'll do is reload my previous save, jump back to the station I just left, all right, go back to the teleporter to my jump off port and point, and we're gonna switch up to the explorer and go uh, take down some. Uh, uh, jump onto this, try to get this yellow, yellow freighter tonight. Heck yeah. <laughs> My wife, she's so supportive and lovely. <laughs> Uh, sword is this one? No, this isn't. This this is my um, 
Uh, let's see, this is the uh, new next save I started with Simtex when next dropped. That I I played it for a few weeks until they got the uh, once they got the glitch worked out with the patch to let us have a. Uh, max slots on the uh, suit upgrades with our legacy saves that's when I dropped this uh, save and just let it set dormant and it really it set dormant until like here in the last month or so I think I jumped on it a couple Saturdays back and or well, about a month ago hold on a second Sorry guys. Okay, if I send a message to 1701D, will you get it? Black box. Oh man, it ain't a big deal. Yeah, you can send it to that one if you want. Um, send it to send it to this main one. It, it I mean, it'll black bar, but it ain't gonna matter. I'm crap, dude. I've been reloading saves for an hour and 45 minutes. So ain't nobody gonna mind the black bar popping up. Dark Lord first try. <laughs> I will when I get done. Thank you. My wife brought me some salt and pepper chicken tenders home from work. Delish. Alright. Nice, nice, buddy. Alright, so this is a uh, this is Jarrett 7 here, guys. Pop over to the uh, pop over to the uh, jump offs and get back over in that section of the galaxy that I just got the orange holler from. As soon as I as soon as I quit moving out on the uh, terminus, that 500 is looking dang cool. Heck yeah, Ballista Cola. Reloading saves is like Quantum Leap. The TV show, nice. Cool, cool, man. No problem. Pop it off. Yeah, if you send it on my main, I can I can uh, check it on my phone while uh, while I'm streaming. All right, debris colony. I think that's gonna be it right there. Heck yeah. Then y'all get to see my um the base I started with my uh, 1701D account today. I actually started a uh, 30 36 circuit board farm uh, today. Got everything in but the uh, star bulb. I ran out of star bulb. And was not foot. Was was not not ready to go looking for more star bulbs. So I just uh, I just caught it in a day and uh, jumped over to this account. Cool, cool, buddy. Definitely, definitely awesome freaking day. My goodness. Alright. Let's get this back up and. Alright, cool, cool. Heck yeah, Let's see. My farm is 30 circuit board farm plus chlorine leaf. Cool, cool, Mario. Heck yeah. Alright, guys, and this is my little. My little no no roof shack I built just to, just to get a jump point. This is what I've been working on today right here. Reddish orange reddish orange grass. Ah, oh, it's not gonna pop in. What? Oh, I haven't uploaded it. That's why. Check this out, guys. I dropped a base up here. <laughs> The uh, the biodomes hang out over over each all four sides. Yep, yep. All right, cool, cool. No big loss. I'll have it uploaded soon. But yeah, we got this thing set up. Uh, tell you what, let's call the freighter in. Hope I don't crash. Hang on a sec, guys.
Alrighty. Let's get far enough away from this planet I can call my freighter in. Eventually. Alright. Ah, oh, come on. That's something I wish they would start patching. Is the uh, freighter summon. It is much annoying. I start getting in the habit of calling that thing in before I leave the before I leave the surface. There we go. Hmm. All right, guys. And I believe this is the A class. Uh, when <laughs> me and me and Simtex got in a little shoot match. Uh, on one of our on one of our noobs in space episodes and I think he almost had me killed and I took off and jumped in my ship and took off well he jumped in his ship to come after me and I warped into a system and when I warped into the system it was into a freighter battle and I got this A I think it's A33 A34 something like that A33 <laughs> picked up an A33 when I warped into this, when I, when I warped into the system, so, heck yeah! All right, let's grab the explorer before I crash. Get out of here, freighters! Freighters in YouTube in No Man's Sky is not a very healthy combination. And there's Cornelius, and there is I can't remember what I called this one. I think it's Mass Moon. Murasami. There we go. Cool, cool. 15 minute timer starts. I hear you, buddy. Alright, guys. Let's see what we got going on here. Let's see if my waypoint held out. First of all. And it did. Cool. Nice. Now, let's see if I get lucky and warp into a freighter battle, guys. What's going on, Siege Ninja? How are you doing, man? Oh, luck and Padre. Heck yeah, buddy. Glad to have you. Heck yeah. Awesome night. Awesome night, man. Freaking 500 subs. Got my candy corn holler in the S class. Hopefully, hopefully, I'll run across this uh this freighter battle, freighter battle, and uh can jump right on into an S class uh yellow Death Star or Star Destroyer and come on yes freighter battle guys heck yeah guys best stream ever come on come on get out from behind that one there he is quit running Barrels. All right, time to fly. Time to fly. See how fast we can knock this one out. Got him. Ah. Oh man, how freaking cool would this be if it was the S class on the first round? Y'all guys, y'all guys' heads would explode, wouldn't it? <laughs> Bet the battle, heck yeah. Yo, John, fancy seeing you here. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> uh, let's see, only strongest sperm will survive. <laughs> Biology's been. <laughs> 
Oh, so you haven't fixed any of your ships from Clifford. Yeah, I know. It is a... Uh, it's brutal, but it, I don't know. If you careful... It's a moderator party. I know, man. Everybody was here for the uh, Oprah show. I'll give everybody a wrench. You get a wrench. You get a wrench. Heck, yeah. I'd have to hide my jealousy. I know, I think he's still, I think Funny's still mad at me or still salty. I got that one on the third try the last time. <laughs> Sprint Freighter. A34, dude. A34 on the first try. But you know what? We're going to decline it, guys. We're going to decline it. I am going for S or, S or nothing less. All right, cool, cool, cool. Reload to save. Heck, yeah. So close, I know, I know. Hang on a second. Sorry about that, guys. Heck yeah. Yeah, third try was something. I know, I came back to chat from work, and the first comment I see is only the strongest person I've ever I know. <laughs> <laughs> Heck yeah. Uh oh. Oh, I left for my freighter. Okay, cool, cool. So I landed in my freighter. Cool, cool. So let's grab my. Let's grab the Explorer. And get on with it. Let's create an auto save too so I can leave for my Explorer. Alright. Jump point set. Let's go. I named it Cornelius 500 Panda. <laughs> Heck yeah. All right, guys. And I will tell you this right now, I am not planning on streaming this if it goes long. <laughs> We'll stream a while through these freighter battles, but if it, if it's gonna be brutal, brutal, yeah, we're not we're not getting the S class in this stream. <laughs> I'll go ahead and make that real clear, cause I ain't staying up no four o'clock in the morning getting in S class battles. <laughs> if you think about it, this chat is 100% strongest sperm. I hear you, buddy. I hear you, Captain Obvious. <laughs> All right, battle time, guys. Black bar. Alright, he was gonna come by this way. Let's get underneath this freighter this time. Take him out. Nope. Right there he goes. Done. Next, please. There he is. Oh, cool, cool. They lining up in a row for me. Sweet. Figure out how far to lead him when I ain't got the. Cool, cool, nice. Landing in the freighter fort tells me they're defeated. <laughs> My ship is always named the Ford F-150. <laughs> Fixed for repair dots. <laughs> John, you're right. Cool, cool, cool. Put your rubber hats on to avoid the friction. <laughs> oh my goodness, guys. Almost 500 comments, guys. Sweet. You can scan the freighter when you hop out. No, you can't until you buy it, John. To Zionize Cobalt. <laughs> oh, it was sleeting earlier down here, but uh, we ain't got nothing nasty yet. It's supposed to sleep pretty hard tonight, but we'll have uh, ice and freezing rain. B class, let's decline it. Heck yeah. 
All right, reload to save. Back to the next battle. Cool, cool. We'll get a lot of pirate killing. A lot of pirate killing practice in tonight, guys. Holy moly. 29 people watching. Jeez. Welcome, guys. Welcome, everybody. You named it Cornelius. Yes, I did, dude. Cornelius 500. Nice 501. Awesome. Heck, yeah. Sweet. Heck yeah. Holy moly, guys. Dang. Go, baby, go. Only seen one dipple. They aren't rare. Diplo or dipple? Oh, man, all heat, no snow over here. Dang, Siege. Uh, like and sub if you haven't already. Thank you, Siege. Thank you. All right. What? I thought... I reloaded in my, I created autosave in my uh, Explorer. Where did it go? Here it is. Okay, cool, cool. It just reloaded. Let's do it again over here while it's parked on this side. That way there won't be no confusion on the next reload. Let's roll. Diplo fever is an actual disease. <laughs> Right. Come here. There he is. Really? There he is. Cool. Zerk, are you in Western Maryland? I think we're I think we're at age yet just yet here. I was doing my freighter battle with only the photon cannon, no upgrades in an S class hauler. Dang, lava. I mean, oh, heck yeah, 31 watches, sweet. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, um, it's doable. The pirates, the, the pirate AI in the uh, freighter battles is really, really easy. I just, uh, I prefer, like I said, with the, the, with the cyclotron, man, it's short work. All right, guys, next battle, please. Oh, cool. RNG switched up a little bit because that pirate is further or closer to the ship. Almost got him. He's done for now. What? Oh, I can't believe I missed that. Such a noob. Such a noob. I didn't miss that time, did I? That's right. Let's go ahead and get my freighter back in my sights. If I don't, it might disappear on me. Good gracious, that's why I missed the other freighters parked in his butt. Swordmaster Pirate. <laughs> oh, oh, what's up, John Smith? New question. If I buy a new freighter, will I lose the equipment in my old freighter? Um, what do you mean equipment? Uh, any any of your farm build in your in your old freighter, if you don't tear it down, uh, it will be you can uh, you can build a previous base or a pre previous base item collector and get half the resources back for what you had in that freighter. But yeah, if you're planning on doing like an extended, if you got a certain freighter that you're trying to get and you get everything saved up, ready to do the, like I'm doing here with this freighter, uh, go ahead and tear down your base so you'll get all your resources back, but you only get half of it back um, if you don't tear it down and trade. Let's see. Did you do, yes, that's lava. Oh, been on and off since about four. Oh, I hear you, man. You just have to rebuild it. Only half the resource to save. There you go, there you go. Ah, John, John, John posted it while I was saying it, or before I said it. 
Uh, three days in a new survival game, but the freighter is max size. Star Destroyer will be freebie. Nice. Yeah, the one I got on the... When I picked this one up in the other save, it was my free freighter. I was very happy about that. All right, reload the save, guys. Let's try this again. Try it again. Start out. They're getting progressively worse, guys. I started out with an A34, then it went to a B class, and it's a C class. All right, Matador, man, have a good one. We'll see you when you get back. If you can, if you if you back in time, heck yeah, man. Man, I learned the hard way in Atlas Rises. My starter freighter, I had built to the max size lubricant farm in my planetary circuit board farm. I'd harvest extra frost, frost crystal for living glass. Cool, cool, cool. Ooh, that's a gross freighter. Man, this thing is sweet, man. It's yellow. It looks worse than it actually is, but it is sweet, man. Heck yeah, I haven't seen very many solid yellow or yellow freighters. It looks kind of day glow, but when you get uh, into like a dark lit system, uh, after you purchase it, it looks a lot better. All right, let's see. I'm getting ready to go have to throttle a child, so if I had to mute out again, guys, bear with me. It might take a few more minutes this time. What in the world did I just do? Alright, let's try this again. Ow. Oh. What that was. Okay. Sent me to the other side of the galaxy at my other waypoint, I reckon. Oh, let's see. Okay, I think it's time to let this pre-next holler go. It was turned into one of the one of the Lava Lamp 64 favorite box nodes. Been holding on to it in hopes that ship custom customization so I could change it back. <laughs> oh, it's saying that it's the classes. Oh, okay, cool, cool. Oh, man. But I think it's time to move on. I hear you, man. Yeah, time to move on, man. Let them go. Let them go. Anybody want to get inspired shower curtain? Nice, Meridius. <laughs> Me too, man. I have a baller. Baller is my primary, and my old one is simply tech module stores. Nice. All right, switching to Cyclotron, and this might be C-Class Junk. The uh, pirate starting out in the same spot again. All right, he's done. He's moving on to the next wave. Let's get him on the way here, guys. Lead him, lead him, lead him, lead him, lead him. Got him. Ah, oh, here we go. And here we go. Lock on. Done. Next wave. Hit the booster. Ah, oh, he's too close. Dang it. There we go. Now you've done it. Let me get behind you. Let me get behind you. Nice barrels. Was that it? Is that him? Alright. Oh gosh, what a pro. <laughs> uh, nah, I mean, Cyclotron makes it so easy, especially with Explorer, because they're really, really agile as far as handling. So you, basically, you just, I mean, once you've been in enough pirate battles, it ain't skill, it's just, you know, muscle memory. <laughs> you kind of get a feel of how far to lead them by how far you are. Um, but yeah, guys, <laughs> it's, it's not... Plus that, and I kind of like the space battles. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Uh, let's see. Cool, cool, cool. Let's see. Where am I at here? Cool, cool, cool. Bought my first capital ship and found out it was gone. Let's see. Cool, cool. Okay, I think it's time. Okay, got you, got you. Read that one. Oh, let's see. <laughs> nice. Now where the? Uh oh. Ah, I know what the problem is. Hang on, say let me switch this thing over to live chat. I think I missed Ballista Cola's message. I think. Somewhere. <gasps> Whoa! There's Zane. What is up, Zane's world, dude? Heck yeah. 
popping in for five before sleepy times. Congrats on the 500 subs, man. What is it? Thank you, dude. Heck yeah, dude. Oh my goodness. So, so happy. Let's see. Box news haulers remind me of semi trucks. I always call them over the top. Remember the special size, <laughs> special slow movie. Nice. What is up? Got Zane's World hanging out in the chat. Good grease, man. Heck yeah, dude. Thank you for hang. Thank you for popping in, dude. Much, much appreciated. And thank you for the congratulations, man. That. Yeah, I'm stoked, guys. I'm stoked. I'm stoked. Let's see. Ship hunting time. Heck yeah. Uh, only so many ways to show off in this guy. I hear you. I hear you. Enjoy sleep. See you tomorrow. Heck yeah, man. Get you some rest, man. We're looking forward to the stream tomorrow. Definitely, definitely. Heck yeah. There are like 10 mods here. I know, man. I tell you. I ain't stingy with my wrenches. <laughs> well, I'll be honest with you, though. I, most trolls... Most trolls show up into my chat and see how many blue wrenches is floating around, and they don't even bother. Like, <laughs> you'll see a surge every now and again, and the viewers you'll see like two or three pop in at a time, and then they'll go right away. That's usually because they're just trolls jump in and say, "Yeah, I ain't gonna be able to say anything. Let me go ahead and close this out." <laughs> VW Bug Freighter. All right, guys, Zane's here. Let's see if it's an S class. Ah, C class. Brutal. Panda popped in a minute ago while I was hunting the uh, the uh, candy corn hauler dude, and uh, as soon as he spoke up and I read the chat, I checked the ship and it was S class. I was like, sweet. Heck yeah, heck yeah. Mods, you're funny. <laughs> uh, see, old school. Heck yeah, man. All right, cool, cool, cool. Getting the dry mouth tonight, guys. Too excited. Got me nervous. I think I may may have to break out the Red Bull here in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Heck yeah, Zane. He's singing, you're on easy street. It feels so sweet because the world is but a treat when you're on easy street. <laughs> oh, man, yeah. I can hear that. I can hear that. I can hear that song playing in my head, dude. <laughs> definitely guys hey and any of you guys viewing you see that that beautiful beautiful blue x icon in the chat there that is zane's world probably one of the most comprehensive no man's sky uh, uh guide providers and and content providers guys go smack that like go smack his uh sub button check his channel out guys because uh Dude is a freaking genius, and if you get when you go check out his channel, go back in his history a bit and check out the uh, video he put up for S Class Freighter Battles or S Class Freighter Purchase. I can't remember the name of the title, but oh my god, dude, I haven't laughed that dang hard in my life. Super super funny guy, guys. Carl. <laughs> Let's see how many wrenches it take to fix a sword. A bunch, apparently. <laughs> All right, let's get on it, guys. Let's get on it. It's time to kill some pirates. Pirate scum, time to die. I want your S-class freighter. Bleedy, bleedy, bleedy. All right, next. Got him. Next. <laughs> oh, blush. <laughs> Hashtag blush. Heck yeah, man. Apparently quite a few marines. <laughs> I can't even count the number of times I've sent people to say, I know, I know, man. Guys, definitely, definitely check him out. I'll tell you what, let's go ahead and get let's go ahead and get this sorted before I pop up in there real quick. Uh, let's see, here we go. Boom, had it up handy. There we go. Now we go to Copy link and back to the stream chat and come on. Ah ha ha! Funny imps beat me to it. 
There you go, guys. There you go. Heck yeah, man. Check out Zane's world, man. Yeah. He is a he's a cool guy. Definitely, definitely good friend, good streamer. And uh, you're missing out if you ain't checking out that channel, guys. That that's that's all I'm gonna say about that, cause you know I know I I, I know him enough to know that his face is like really really deep deep uh reddish right now, so very very funny. <laughs> Thank you, Cassie. Definitely, definitely. I know, I know. I was at like a 496, 497 when I started the stream today. Definitely been a great night, guys. Heck yeah. And we're going to leave. And that C-Class junk is just not good enough to be part of the sword stream. I almost wanted to shoot the thing and destroy it. <laughs> you turned me on before bed struck him. There you go. <laughs> I like this. Cool, cool. Heck yeah, man. Pop on in any time, brother. Oh, I'm tired. My humor gets weird. <laughs> it's all right, dude. <laughs> Trust me. Man, if you caught the last 30 minutes of my stream, and I'm going to tell you right now, guys, I do apologize. Because, um, man, I'm telling you what, I was struggling that last 30 minutes last night. I was building a base. I had worked all day. I mean, it was a, like a 14 and a half, 15 hour day. I was plumb whacked when I, before I even went live. Down to Red Bull thinking that would help. And it, and it did for a while. But man, that last half an hour building that base was just like, oh, uh, zombie mode. But yeah. But definitely, definitely hats off to you guys that hung around for the whole stream because that was epic. Let's see, just look. At it for a few minutes, almost forgot to navigate the old freighter thing. <laughs> nice. Nice. I was getting ready to say, you, you're, you're funny when you're serious, Zane. <laughs> oh, man. Heck yeah, guys. Definitely, definitely great stream tonight. Not just, uh, and, and like I said, it's, it's you guys out there. It's it's not the content. It's you guys hanging out in the chats. What makes it so cool and much appreciated. All right, get rid of the black bar. Let's go. Let's switch to Cyclone. Dive for the freighter. Gotcha. All right. We're shooting the NPCs, I'll be all right. Come on, S class, guys. Come on, S class. It's already twice as hard as the last one I got. <laughs> uh, let's see. Manuel Batista. What is going on, Manuel? How are you today? Glad to have you. Pull you up a beanbag. Kick back. We're probably going to be here a while fighting these S class or fighting this freighter battle, trying to find us an S class. But that's all right. I got plenty of time and uh am, am committed to the S class venture, so we're gonna we're gonna get this ship in S class guys. Last try car before sleepy. Time to go S class. I know man. Let's go Zane's S class. Nope. B class. <sighs> yep. Definitely, definitely going definitely definitely can't wait till I get a... Till I get Discord popped in through the stream, and then that way I can just get Zane to come on and do funny, funny voices. <laughs> Heck yeah, man! I'm doing awesome tonight, dude. Definitely been a great night, Freighter Captain. I know, man. 
And he's a get too, man. I'll get Cobra out here to shoot him in the face. Serial pirate killer on the hunt. That's what it is, man. I'm kind of rooting for the C-classes so I can kill some more pirates. <laughs> it's already twice as hard as the last time. I know, man. I know. <laughs> Zane, dude, the other night I, I run across this S-class and it was yelling. I said, I'm getting this S-class on my, on my new save. And I set it up, got it, and went through. I think I fought three three battles and took it out and got an S class dude funny imps funny imps like really <laughs> what is going on the Fonzie how are you doing buddy good seeing you and glad to have you man <laughs> named is Teddy Can Sam <laughs> Toucan Sam or Teddy Can Sam <laughs> Oh, gotta go now. Was counting on that fray. I hear you, Siege. I hear you. What is going on, man? All right, let's get back up here to the waypoint. Them pir them pirates are. St we've given too long of a break. They they might have to. Up they might might be upgrading their their uh, pirate ships. I done it again. I hit the wrong button sometimes, and it just portals me back to across the galaxy. All right. Let's hit the right button this time. All right, pirates had a break. They took, they took five. I let them smoke a cigarette. It's time to get back at it. Only discovered your channel tonight. Loving your laid-back style. Greetings from England. Need to start playing it. Definitely, man. Definitely check it out, man. Give this game another shot, cause uh, with the with the next Abyss and Visions update, this is almost a new game, guys. You're generally happy outlook willed it as S class only logical explanation <laughs> no really I, I definitely like freighters freighters I've been having some super luck with here lately definitely have not had to put a bunch of, which I honestly I don't think I've ever spent as much time as some people have on the on freighter battles I just uh, for one I won't put that much time into it I'll just come on and you know move on to another one and try again later or something but heck yeah Ah! Hit him in the face. There we go. You shouldn't hit the brakes, brother. That, that was on you. If you kept punching it, you might have survived. How'd I lose the uh, pirate? I had him locked on. Oh, you didn't let me get behind. You're in trouble now. Eat it. Ah! Gotcha. Give me them barrels. Ah, oh, go hide behind the freighter. Pirate battles leading up to Ace Combat 7 Friday. <laughs> gotta get my air, gotta get my space combat in before I go into the aerial combat. Ah, quit running, quit running, stop running. There we go. What's going on, Commander Argo? How you doing, buddy? Let's see, Christopher LeBlanc, welcome and thanks for the kind words. One, two, three. Heck yeah, man. Very much appreciated. And definitely, definitely come back anytime. Like I said, dude, hey, Kane, if, uh, definitely, if you're getting back into No Man's Sky, man, Zane's World, I don't, uh, see, so you're from England, so it's probably good grief, man. It's already pushing, uh, like 12 o'clock for you. Dude, um,. I know it's probably around five o'clock your time tomorrow. That beautiful, beautiful guy, Zane's World, just below your last comment, man. Go sub that channel and check him out. About five, five p.m. your time tomorrow, he should be going live with No Man's Sky Survival Save. Check him out. Definitely a good place to hang out. I'll usually go live maybe half an hour to an hour after he does on Sunday. So definitely, definitely keep an eye out for that lineup, guys. Let me see, cool, cool, Fonzie doing good, getting ready to start a new save, awesome, dude, heck yeah, chip, chip, cheerio, <laughs> Christopher, <laughs> oh, another, I tell you, man, like, like, Americans can't stand to hear me talk, but like, like, uh, British and European, it's like, kind of like a unique accent, because y'all guys call it an accent, 
everybody over here calls it redneck. <laughs> so I, I carry I carry a lot more uh, viewership from from over from across the pond, guys. Hey, sore. When did visions drop? Been away from the dude, man. Visions dropped uh what a month or so ago, two months ago. It was a uh, we got the um we got abyss at Halloween. I think uh, visions right before uh Thanksgiving. So heck yes, yeah. so it's been about two months, but it's definitely definitely well worth it, man. Let's see. Do do do, Commander Yo. Bye. Sleep time. See you, Zane. Have a great night, dude. Much, very very glad you stopped by, man. Let's see, we got it. Thanksgiving, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, man, definitely check it out. Heck yeah, Kane. Definitely, man, check him out. He's a very cool guy, man. Very cool guy, and he's one of them peeps that, like, he's given me a lot of advice, you know, with, with streams and with other things, and, and I mean, I, I, I consider him a friend. He's a really good guy, so go check his channel out. Um, heck yeah. Dude, so chub, just made 59 plants. Nice, John. Witless, witless mass. My best friends are rednecks. <laughs> nice. Uh, oh, sword LL. Took a minute for, for, took a minute to get used to, but it's endearing. I'm West Coast, so everyone has an accent. <laughs> Let's see, been moving myself. So been moving myself, so been away for everything for like three months. Oh, okay, dude. Cool, cool. Glad to have you back, man. Heck yeah. Where in the world? Okay, cool, cool. Yeah, okay, good, good, good. Oh, uh, heck yeah. Oh, uh, wait, what happened to Sim? Oh, man, Sim Sim started playing Boundless, and I think the Debs abducted him. <laughs> I like to call your accent Twang. Heck yeah, Christopher. That's what we call it. <laughs> Southern Twang. You know you're a redneck when you try to look for your redneck. <laughs> nice one, Meredith. Heck yeah. Come on. Ah, another B class. What a rip off. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. More pirates to kill. That's what it means, guys. It's just more pirates to kill. Heck yeah, Ballista Cola. Yeah, definitely. If you like the earlier in the day streamer, Ballista Cola is definitely a cool cat to go check out as well, man. He just uh, done his face reveal last week. And a uh, very, very handsome British fella. And a... Uh, one of the one of the one of the well I, I lurk at a lot of places but i probably lurk the most at ballistas because uh he does a lot of streaming in the earlier mornings for me uh being on the east coast and i get to hang out a lot in his uh i get to hang out and lurk it a little bit in, his, in a lot in his streams because he's on when there ain't very many people streaming and it's during my work day so i can something to keep me occupied while i'm working Nice, John. That planet I put a base on has small dip loads. Cool lava. Heck yeah. What is going on, Jefferson? Welcome, man. Glad to have you, man. It's not a redneck. It's a hillbilly. <laughs> I know. I know. So you know, you know you're redneck when WD, WD-40 proceeds anything with duct tape to fix it. Yeah, definitely. Duct tape, clothes hanger, WD-40 don't fix it. You got problems, guys. You got problems. Heck yeah. This ever elusive redneck sighting like a Jim Kent babysitter. <laughs> nice. Oh, I love Sword of Strange. Reminds me when I lived in the South. Nice. <laughs> cool, cool, cool. Oh, let's see. Still here funny lurking, making videos for Monday. Nice. Heck yeah, buddy. Cannot wait. All right, let's go. Let's go spank some more pirates, guys. I think I've given them. I think I give them enough time to recuperate. Hopefully, I don't. I, I, you know, I try to give them a little bit of a chance. I know. I know. They're NPC pirates, guys. You know, freighter battle pirates. It's the, you know, you got to give them every leg up they can just to make it interesting. But yeah, it's like, eh. I think they, I think they would make it more interesting if they just tuck tail and started running, and you had to go chase them down. <laughs> Heck yeah, let's get it done, guys. Time to go. Let's go. Let's go. There we go. Black bar is gone. Ah, there we go. Switch the cyclotron. Take him out through the asteroid, guys. Done.
Ah, oh, missed him. Missed that one. Snuck up on me. There it is. Alright, get him, get him, get him. Fancy flying, but it don't help. What? Post some bitch later. Cool, buddy. Cool. Yeah, those pirates ought to run. They know it's best for them. I know. I know. Oh, an editing bit. Cool, cool. Heck yeah, man. See B class experimental white or black check pattern in a station. Oh, nice lava. Cool, cool. All right, let's let's go for an S class. This guy got time, guys. Let's get it done. Let's get it done. All right, let's see, Christopher LeBlanc. I have a question for anyone with an answer. Why can some people allow music streaming in their channel without facing copyright strike? There's actually a copyright-free music that you can download, Chris. There's actually like places like um, uh, SoundCloud, and I can't think of all of them. I, uh, but yeah, actually has uh, people that make copyright-free music. And you can download it and use it in your streams, and it won't it won't uh, tag you. I think that's where um, uh, MZK got burnt a while back. Um, he had downloaded some uh, copyright free music and uploaded it into a um, uploaded his uploaded it into one of his videos, and a, another artist had uh, took that that song or that music and actually oh cool 833. And it actually uh, filed the patent to copyright it, and he got a copyright strike on that video because of that one song. And it was playing throughout quite a bit of his video, so you pretty much you got to re-edit re the video, or just more or less it's easier to just take the video down and, and create a new one with different music. But yeah, he got burned on that deal. Bless the cold, my PSN is Pilgrim 921. If if you friend, cool, cool. Let's see, the NPCs are like the crew who have. The red shirts in Star Trek, they always die. <laughs> I know. Alright, let's get out of this menu and reload it save, guys. Time for another set of pirate death. But I mean, people can type in SR song title and artist, and then it either plays it or cues it. Um, I don't know. I don't know, Chris. I know, um, Ah, some stuff you get away with. I don't think it really... I don't think YouTube really busts your chops for anything until you get monetized. And then, uh, worst case scenario, the monetization from that from that stream, uh, a portion of it or some of it goes towards... That. I know Zane could probably answer it a lot better than I can, but like I said, I'm, I'm still 499 away from monetization, so I haven't really given it a lot of give it a lot of thought <laughs> but yeah <laughs> definitely definitely guys oh if I quit hitting the square button I don't even know what the square button does but it, it's annoying I know that much what does the square button do didn't say okay all right let's get back up to my waypoint where'd it go there it is cool hit the not you hit that nope not you holy cow my thumbs ain't working they're not pirates so I can't peg them out man let's see Burger King might sponsor no man's sky stream music if you don't mind the king and farming burgers <laughs> you know, funny I'll be streaming another game I'm getting a no man's sky video in there cool 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 man after selecting a star, it creates a waypoint. Um, well, no, like, 
when I like where you would normally hit X to open the system and warp there, I, I've been hitting the square and it's dropping me back to the uh, Jarrett Seven uh, base. I think it's like a previous mission or something like that. Yeah. Slightly annoying, but it's my own fault. So, all right, switch up to Cyclotron. Let's take these puppies out, man. See how much faster I can get at this. There we go. Now let's get him, get him, get him, get him. Whoa! He got by me. That's rare. I have to quit giving them so many breaks. Start staying on them more. They getting better. Now where is the last one? There he is underneath. You are done, sir. What? Did he survive? There he didn't. <laughs> I'm getting cocky. I'm just shoot I'm just unloading on him with the uh with the positron or with the cyclotron and then for it for for it even hits him I just turn and fly away. <laughs> I've been I've been doing that a little bit the last couple battles <laughs> and I, I realized I didn't take them out. <laughs> now if, it, if I was in my fighter with a 59% damage bonus, yeah. You you just barely got to graze them with the uh with the cyclotron and they're done. <laughs> in the explorer it's a little bit more difficult proposition with like I think it's uh, Ah, I think it's a zero on the damage or a, or a 15 percent. Somebody, it's not much. All right, let's see. S class. No. Son of a gun. All right. Oh crap! Sorry guys. Sorry about the blue screen. Wrong button. All right. Reload. Save. <laughs> All right, guys. Back at it. Back at it. All right. Good stuff. Might have to break the Red Bull out, guys. This might take a little while. <laughs> Sean Murray's over in Guilford saying, I let you have one the other night. You're not getting two swords. You're just not getting two. It ain't happening. We're we going to troll you. I, I, you know, they, they done sent me messages that you were uh, that you were trying for two. We're going we're gonna, to we're gonna put the troll button on. And you're only gonna get A classes the best the rest of the night. But that's all right, Sean. That's all right. I'm persistent, and I done it again. Son of a gun! Really? Was that three times in a row for me now? Good grief! I learned how to play No Man's Sky sometime this week. I promise. <laughs> it's not cheating if you know how the game works. Heck yeah, man. Thinking about ditching my Legacy S Class fighter, getting a new one. Heck yeah, man! Keep it mixed up. Yeah, you got to, two, two, John. You got to keep in, uh, keep in consideration sentimental value, guys. Like I said, you always got to have at least one ship in your arsenal that you're never going to get rid of. Remember, remember how long it took you to get it, or, or how cool it was when you found it, kind of situations. be honest with you that's why I have so many accounts <laughs> all right hit the pulse hit the pulse not the not the cycle strong like mr. Magoo in space oh he got by me I should have done loaded on him I'm trying trying to give him a chance and only hitting him in spurts with the uh, cyclotron but didn't seem like that's being. Oh, 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 he got that one in the face. That's why you don't pirate with shuttles, guys. Done.
<laughs> 48 slot S class haulers. So hard to find, especially the gull wing models. Oh man, Commander Argo, they've actually boosted them up a little bit, man. I've run across quite a few gull wings here lately. Been seeing a lot more ballers as well. You just gotta, you just gotta catch the right system. I think uh, it may be the system I'm in's got a yellow hawk wing with uh, no tail, or it's either got no tail or it don't have a, a winglets on the tail. Oh, let's see. Couch. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> oh, B class. Well, at least it wasn't a C. Reload to save, guys. Reload to save. Let's roll. See, I know of a Red Hawk Wing that's one of the first ships to fly in the space station after reloading. Heck yeah, dude. I'm in Euclid and I have one, but it took weeks and weeks of searching before I got it. Dang, dude. I'll tell you what, Commander Argo. Uh,. I got a. Uh, I don't know if you, I don't know if you've joined the Discord or not, but uh, if you'll check the links in the description in my in my uh, YouTube channel, I have links to the FDI Amino Hub uh, and the uh, Amino Amino Hub or the Amino Hub Amino, and to the Noob Nation Nexus Discord, and we have a uh, screenshots and a screenshot channel in the uh, the Discord. And the uh, the amino hubs are are really both hubs are like really really cool with the wikis and the information that we put out there for um, uh, for the uh, like rare finds and really cool stuff. So definitely definitely a great resource. Let's hit the right button this time. We done it. We done it, guys. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. What is up, Connors? How are you doing, buddy? Heck yeah, dude. Glad to have you. Sweet. It's the same system. I found that blue squid. Cool, John. Cool, cool. Heck yeah. Alright. So wheat. Alright, cool. Alright, cool, cool. Now let's go kill some more pirates, guys. Come at him with fury this time. Oh, can I get him? Can I get him? Can I get him? No, let's go under him. There we go. Now he's dead. Got him. My laser scalpel. What is that? Cyclotron. There he went. And the cool thing is, if you, if you get in enough of these pirate fights, you kind of, you can kind of predict what they're going to do when they when they zip past you. Most of them usually bank, uh, fly when they fly over you, they bank to the right or left and try to double back on you. And if you slam on the brakes and cut it right or left, you can almost beat them to it. And when you get lined back up on them, you're behind them. Who says shuttles are bad for pirates? <laughs> well, except for Dark Lords and his glitch shuttle that has like a million damage. Oh, cool, cool, cool. What's up, John? You know me, Sword? I always gotta make an appearance in my American No Man's Sky, brother. Heck yeah, buddy. What's going on, Fido? How are you doing, man? Glad to have you. Good to see you, man. Sword, you decide you need a new freighter. This is a new save of Fonzie. I I've gotten, um,. Oh man, I've gotten five saves that are fairly decent shape. Most of them are already maxed out and and, so, and statted out, and then I got a couple uh, like this one that I started with next. Well, this one I started with next drop, but as soon as the uh, fixed a few a uh, uh, few uh, issues with the legacy saves, I, um, I come you know I went back to my legacies, but. Um, I'm about got to the point where I'm trying to do a few things, and this one had an A-class uh, freighter in it, so I decided to 
chase this uh, yellow one down and get into that portion of the system so I can come get it uh, tonight. So, uh, cool, cool, cool. Heck yeah, fighter. Doing well. Great, great, buddy. Cool, cool. All right, guys. I'm going to tell you what. I am going to uh, mute out for just a minute. Um, let everybody get a chance to stretch their legs, do a couple jumping jacks, as the law of evolution would say. Uh, get the blood pumping and flowing. And then I'm going to grab me a soda, grab my backup can of Red Bull, and then we're going to get this thing a kicking, guys. So I'll be right back. All right, guys, we're back, we're back, cool, cool. All right, guys, felt good to get up and stretch them legs out. All right, let's go, let's go kill some pirates again, guys. longer to load guys it might be an S class this time something's changed something's going on my goodness here we go let's get it let's get it jump out there we go Formation this time. It's alright. It ain't gonna save me. Eh, they might have been the same formation. Oh, there he is. Hey, one more. I thought I was done. I was, I was already doing the, the victory lap. class time guys it's class medium first wave holler just now pretty sweet don't want it but it looks cool awesome John heck yeah man that's the one thing I've learned about this no man's sky crowd in this community guys it doesn't matter what it look like somebody's gonna want it <laughs> But yeah, I'm hoping, I'm hoping we get an update this year that, uh, that gives us, uh, different body styles, different classes, different, you know, that they go in and, uh, uh, refurbish the ships a little bit. C-class jump. All right. So uh, it's a medium. Oh man, a medium economy. Ugh. I'm just doing the daily exploration event. I always check. Oh, cool, 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 man. Definitely, definitely. Yeah. Cool, cool, cool. Except I'm the only one who likes the box nose haulers. <laughs> nah, there's more of you out there, man. You're you're a small subset of the No Man's Sky community, but you still you still you still got a few people that like them. Which, I mean, I've seen some cool ones, but, uh, yeah. Oh, 
Alright, power it, get it That's exactly why I've been posting most things I see. Someone someone I might roll my eyes some some of my, something I might roll my eyes at might be someone else. Someone's forever ship. Yeah, exactly, funny imps. Let's see, my first A class holler was a box nose right before I got my first heavy fighter. Nice, nice. Yeah, funny imps got like a really, really cool uh uh, uh explore. This I don't know if it's small or medium, but it's it's not yeah, it's it's a cool looking little ship, but I wouldn't have nothing to do with it because of the slot size. Same way with the uh, same way with uh, the exotics. You know, a lot of people love the exotics, and I, you know, I I just uh, no more slots than they have. I just I just can't part, bear myself to uh to have one. But yeah, there we go. Here he is. Oh, I missed him. What? Holy moly. He got skills. Not for long, but he got them. Had them. You see what I mean about them looping when they get past you? If you can kind of predict the loop that they do, then you can be right on top of them when they come out of it. Oh crap. Ah, must hit NPC. Ha ha, loving it. <laughs> okay, cool, it's a medium explorer, cool, cool. I found an all orange box nose, a single box. Size a few days ago, first way. Yeah, man. Which I think since they shortened up the the width of the box wings, they look a lot better. Cause I was uh, looking at one, uh, I couldn't get it to pop in an S class, or I didn't spend enough time to get it to pop in an S class. But uh, it uh, oh crap, I'm getting shot at. <laughs> But yeah, it had the uh, the small box and the little winglet on the on the end of it, on the end of the boxes. I thought it looked pretty cool, but uh, like I said, it wouldn't my uh, it wouldn't worth the the long haul to pick to pick it up. So I found my first hauler, a crashed S class ball hauler. Nice Fonzie, that is awesome, dude. What luck, man. Oh yeah, I really like the new slim down box wing haulers. Yeah, man. Well, let's see, I got one in my, I got a really, really unique hauler in my Legacy save that used to be a box nose with the uh, 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 slanted hawk wings that I picked up. That was the Artemis crash ship. And uh, and then when it got uh, changed over after next, it got uh, where everything else got uh, uh, nerfed. Uh, that one actually turned out to be a really, really cool looking ship because it had a medium body design, but uh, it was an S48 and 8. So, heck yeah. But I was so tickled. I got an S class crash ship on my first, like, oh man, maybe the first three hours of gameplay when I started that save. So, yeah, I was definitely, definitely happy. Let's see, I got it on my old save. Plan to get my survival game or to get it on my survival game when I get all the glyphs cool cool man just posted the one I found on Twitter nice John heck yeah speaking of glad you said something I need to check uh, my messages here oh, okay cool that's what you're talking yeah I know what you're talking about now with the hex wings cool cool I like it man I like it I've seen some uh, medium like that all right, quit playing with the phone and kill some pirates, guys. All right. 
Take him out, take him out. Go guys, boom, and done. All right, let's get this S class, guys. Come on, Sean Murray. All I want is an S class for next one. Check this guy with some Corvax nanites if he don't start coming off some S classes. Awesome, dude. Cool, cool. Alright, let's see. C class, really? Come on! Oh, yeah. You know what it is. I'm streaming it. That's what it is. If, I, if I'd have been. If I'd have been playing off stream, I'd have had this thing in in probably two tries. <laughs> I'm paying for getting the last one in three. I really am. <laughs> Which I did get the uh, honestly, I got the the candy corn hauler a lot quicker than I did Sunday. So, like I said, I had Zane Zane stream up on the laptop Sunday and was just sitting back here reloading saves, waiting on the candy corn to roll in in the S class and. It took almost his whole stream to, to get that in the S class, so yeah, definitely, definitely. Alright, back at it again, back at it again. I ain't even been keeping count on how many freighter battles this has been. <laughs> it's been a few. So it's, it's probably five times as hard already as it was the first time. So. But the ship is kind of worth it. I really, really, really like the yellow Star Destroyer. about hitting the freighter or letting him a shot pop off on the freighter because that would get ugly real real quick get those sentinel chokers after you Through the rock. All right. All right, guys. Let's go see what he has for me. Definitely, definitely hear an easy street playing in the background. I might have to pull it up on my phone and listen to it while I'm doing this. <laughs> my, 
my little motivational song. <laughs> oh my goodness. B class, come on, really? You can do better than that, Mr. Gek. Alright, relay daughter save. Here we go, here we go. It's only fitting. I know, funny. <laughs> you you having a big time watching me suffer through this prater battles. <laughs> oh, it's all right, man. It's all right. No man's sky karma. It comes around and bites me every now and again. <laughs> Some something way, way, way too easy easier than it's supposed to be. I will pay for it soon. Trust me. <laughs> Kind of like John with that Explorer. <laughs> you went and got that Baltastic collar. I couldn't get to pull an S class. And <laughs> now he's suffering through getting that Explorer I got the other night. <laughs> All right, guys, we're going to do it this time. <laughs> Thank you. Time to kill some pirate scum. Try to get them before they put too many dents in my new freighter. Underneath the freighter, that's why I can't go in. making homemade biscuits and spicy sausage gravy going to be an awesome brenner <laughs> nice nice <laughs> bliss is saying 8 30 that's brutal dude Got, see what we got. You sir, I'm in the I'm in the I'm in the market for an S class. B, really? Come on, dude. I'm not saluting you. I'm leaving. You're on your own, man. Heck yeah, man. Definitely. Hang on a second, guys. All right. Next round. Next round.
all right guys we're gonna keep going at it for a while anyway it did but nine o'clock on on the east coast so i got a little while left to go we only been we only been streaming about three hours so yeah we still got a couple hours i ain't even broke out the red bull yet here it goes here it goes here it goes guys here we go here we go that's right that's right red bull time guys I don't think anyone makes them, but there's a place that has them on their menu that are really good. Cool, cool. Oh man, homemade sausage gravy is awesome, dude. Like you get, you can buy the really hot Jimmy Dean, like the sausage you have to patty out, fry it up, and use the. Uh, Use the grease. I think it's flour, milk. I, I'm not that. I'm not good at gravy. Mine don't ever turn out that great. Mine always turns out kind of greasy, but and heavy. But you can make it with that spice, and then with them very, very fresh, very fresh uh, homemade biscuits is freaking awesome, man. Southern eating at its best. I think I clipped the NPC on that one. Y'all guys can take five. I got this. Take it out. Take it out. Take it out. Here we go. There we go. One more. Here we go. Eight hours till I hit 2,000. I'll post a capture on the nation. Nice, KJ. Awesome. What's going on, Nikolai Govin? How are you doing, buddy? Joins in the sort of in the stream and sort of talking about food. This should be good. <laughs> yeah, John Hall's eating breakfast for dinner tonight, guys. Done, done got me craving now. Biscuits and gravy, man. Love it. Staple of every southern breakfast guys that's that's the kind of stuff put some hair on your chest guys especially wintertime food all right s class time no b class son of a gun all right i'm gonna salute you just one time just because i want to s class from you on the next round so you need to you need to Shake out the S-Class for me, guys. Come on. Come on. You can do it. I need one of them S-Class first spawn yellow freighters tonight, guys. Let's get it done. How you doing tonight, Nikolai? Jeez, I had a dream about... I had a dream of going to a wild Waffle House and getting pancakes. It was weird. Ooh. Heck yeah. Going to Waffle House and getting pancakes... You're supposed to get waffles at the Waffle House. You're supposed to get a. You're supposed to get pancakes at IHOP. <laughs> which I, which I, I'm, I'm kind of like that. I go to IHOP. I go to IHOP and order the order the waffles and go to the Waffle House and order the order the pancakes. <laughs> All right, let's get it, get it, get it, get it. I hate to even think how many battles this has been. I should have been writing it down or my little check check sheet here. Keep up with them. I believe it's starting. I believe they're starting to drag out a little bit. But that's okay. My my second favorite pastime is killing pirates. <laughs> Too, too bad I'm reloading my saves and I'm not getting all these ships destroyed in my milestones.
<laughs> I like that one. Delayed reaction destruction. Definitely give me some biscuits and gravy from the local place. Best on breakfast you can get. Best with bacon, grits, and cheesy eggs. Nice, nice. Starting up my new save, but gonna keep the stream going in the background. Awesome, Fonzie. Heck yeah, man. Lurk away, buddy. Lurk away. Trust me. I, I lurk enough that uh, I can definitely appreciate you guys lurking in the, in the stream. Got it going on in the background while you're playing some No Man's Sky. At your workplace, keeping an ear out. Why you? Why you doing your daily grind? I understand. I understand. I've been there. Do it all the time myself. Did you complete the daily com community event? I've been just doing the destruction setting easier to do. I like the exploration, really, Nikolai. And uh, as a matter of fact, I actually double dipped today. I actually did it on on uh, two different saves today. So. <sighs> Brutal S class. Come on, S class. Give it up, guys. How many reloads does it take to get to the center of this S class? Heck yeah. Alright, guys. We'll, we'll, we'll get it. We'll get it. We'll get there. We got plenty of time. We got plenty of time. Alright. And trust me, I will definitely cut bait and run. I will not be doing no eight hour freighter battle stream. <laughs> I like my I like my mental health a lot more than that. Alright, let's roll. is going on against infinity what's up sword thoughts on small updates after ps4 community event ends ah a lot of people have got it in their mind that we're going to get uh, an update after the event when to be honest with you nothing has come out of hello games stating that to be the case and uh, don't get me wrong nothing's wrong with speculating really isn't I and, and I do a lot of it myself and quite enjoy it uh, quite enjoy the speculation myself but what we always got to realize is like my good buddy Panda says don't let your speculation become expectation so as long as we're not expecting an update now if there's one that pops in and it's something cool or if it's just a minor bug patch fix I'll be happy as as I can be but if we don't get one, I'm not going to be disappointed in, in kicking rocks. You know what I'm saying? So, like I said, don't be, don't get your hopes up really high that we're getting a, that we're getting an update after the event. But eh, it's it's very likely we will. But like I said, don't don't bank on it. Uh, looked out again. We're finding new fighter class ship. That has a RDR2, you know, R2D2, you know. Oh, cool, cool. Heck yeah, man. Maybe it's Hello Games New Year resolution to be even more secretive this year. No, no. I th honestly, I think they're doing really well this year, or well, really well since next. When next drop, they are. They've talked and done and posted and, and give up more information. 
to the community than they had probably the year prior. So I'm pretty happy with that. I think, uh, I, I mean, really, I, I think uh, they're going to continue updating the game, and it's still it's just going to keep getting better, in my opinion. I've not been disappointed with any updates since this game since I started playing this game. Uh, but yeah, uh, I don't know. I'm really I'm I'm looking for like a space a space refit or. Ah, uh, I would really like the next update to be space. <laughs> Just the uh, either either that or add more lore. You know, like with um with Abyss, we got a little bit more lore with the uh, storyline leading into Abyss, uh, to where we got our Nautilon and uh, and uh, and underwater base build parts and stuff. I really, I kind of hope they keep doing stuff like that. Uh, because it just adds to the game, uh, especially like guys like me that have, have played a lot and have accomplished most of the tasks and goals and missions that are in a that are in it already. <laughs> Dark Lord Nova is lit next. <laughs> oh my! Oh, you you you, you already uh, three quarters of the way, man. You get a you, if we get an O update, he's gonna be on it. But yeah, I think uh, I think really, guys, if uh, you know anything we get from Hello Games is just icing on the cake so far right now. I mean, that's just next was uh, such a great update to this game, added so much more to the game with game gameplay mechanics, you know, third person views on your ship and EXO, and care with the character models and stuff, customization on your character models. You know, there's so much stuff that they added in Next that, you know, we, we've we been playing it since July and we kind of, I don't know, I think we get a little bit, uh, uh, I think we get a little bit uh, desensitized to it where it's not so fresh and new to us and we kind of forget what we had with 1.3 and where we've come. Um, you know, I, I find it awkward playing in first person anymore now because I'm so used to the character model in the, got him, cool, cool, cool. Um, so used to the character model now that, you know, I find it difficult to play because I do a lot of my base build stuff in a uh, first person because the parts fit together easier in first person, but, but yeah, I've gotten so used to so used to third person now that it's kind of it's kind of awkward to me now you know and it reminds me you know where we've where we've come from in in this game so yeah definitely definitely i would love to have a, I would love to have an, an update after the event but yeah let's see john hall dude these biscuits are rising nicely in the oven awesome man awesome let's see yeah i agree dude with the space side needing update next I want to moonwalk on an asteroid. I hear you. I hear you. See, <laughs> I get that to an extent, but I, I just don't know, guys. I just don't know. Because, see, we're in an exosuit, but you look look at my character model, guys. I'm in an exosuit, but it ain't really a space suit, guys. It's kind of like a... a almost kind of like a diving suit you know you got a little bit of uh, protection with a with a with an oxygen recycler and a cargo container on your back you know with your helmet so it's not like we got no really tricked out spacesuits where we can where we can go in a zero zero atmosphere uh, environment you know so i mean no, you never know we may get that you know look at this troll look at the troll guys a34 slot are you kidding me having a laugh or to or to blaze javelin your beak off for that <laughs> oh man i still fly in first person normally i prefer to build bases in first person but heck yeah exploring in third person hudless is the way to go i hear you or not hudless but definitely like third person cool cool troll boo <laughs> i know man i know Oh man, 
he's lucky I can't pull my multi tool out inside a freighter. He he would he would get it just on principle. <laughs> oh man, gracious. Hey. Sorry, my my youngin's back there playing with his uh, cars with the horns are blowing in the background. My youngest was actually being super, super cool with his headphones on and his tablet behind me. I, I had to look back, make sure he was still there a couple times. I see a year ago before I was rich, I would be like, yeah, Max slots, but I'm an S class for the S class these days. <laughs> All S classes, yeah, I know. He's like, I can't. I can't fly around that eight class garbage. <laughs> oh man, I'm telling you. The longer you play, the more snobby you get when it comes to ships. I like first person in ship mode, easier to fly and less strain on my eyes. Oh man, I'm telling you, that's probably one of probably one of my favorite things is the third uh, third person uh, ship uh, ship view. Good ripple. I like the dashboard details you have in first person view. Yeah, I agree. I know somebody was telling me about the dashboard the other day showing coordinates. I think on my new net on my new save, after I found that crash ship, I was trying to get back to it and I had the coordinates but I could I I was flying and they told me that the coordinates was on the dashboard and I never knew that because to be honest with you since next dropped and I and I realized we had a, a third person uh, ship view I mean very very rarely would I ever switch over to first person in the ship because I just like the I just like the ship so much really I mean if not you just hunt for an s-class cool looking dashboard instead of s-class really cool colored ship you know <laughs> I suggested HG that it would be awesome to get the system's galactic coordinates while we're in while we're in space, like we have the Latin launch planets. Cool, cool. Yeah, that would be pretty cool. Yeah, you never know, man. They do they do some cool stuff every now and again when the community cries out for it or calls out for it. Let's see. Give me a second, Bliss, then I'll read you. Come, I see you pop up, but I can't see it from where I'm sitting. Let me get to the uh, get to the geckiest up here. Let's see. I'm going the other way. I want less slots and going C class. I know, I know. Don't. Oh, cool, cool, cool. All right, let's see. Talk to the geck. Talk to the geck. Come on, man. S class this time, please. Really, really, two A classes back to back. You friggin' troll. What is going on here? Uh-oh. Alright, cool. Alright, cool, cool. Yeah, something got screwy with that one. It would speed up Capital Freighter roll call, you know. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it added after the abyss. Okay, cool, cool. Yeah. Uh, right now, unless you have a manual save on a planet, you can't land on a planet after seeing the space. Otherwise, you'll lose your auto save. Ah, uh, okay, cool, cool. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Cool, cool. All right. Next battle, please. Whew, deep breath, deep breath. <laughs> Didn't explain very well. I had no problem, brother, no problem. Cool, cool. 
Alright guys. Time to kill some more pirates. <laughs> I'm not I know I'm not sounding very excited about it, but after you kill so many of them, you kinda <laughs> He's kinda like, <sighs> kill pirates. Oh man, I missed that big day right there, guys. That's all right. I got him. Got him on the second run. Ah, oh, dang it! That blows. here before the sentinels get to me. <laughs> Bribe the sentinels. <laughs> Think I'm excited about Brenner. Breakfast suits are my favorite type. I like Ron, Ron Swanson. I actually like him. I like Ron Swanson. Nice. <laughs> Alright guys. <laughs> Oh, come on, be the S class since I got the Sentinels after me. I don't even care if it's full price. Nope, C class. What a bunch of mess. Yeah, Sean's then went to bed. He didn't switch. He didn't switch the not the S class button for sword switch over and and went on to bed. <laughs> it's cause John. <laughs> it's cause John. John spelled Sean's name wrong. <laughs> Miri, <laughs> could dang it. <laughs> Heck yeah, guys. Awesome, awesome, awesome. My goodness. That's a lot of, that's a lot of freighter battles, guys. It's a lot of freighter battles. Tell you what, if this one's gonna be if this one's another C, I'm gonna try something a little interesting. I'm gonna go create I'm gonna go to the space station after I leave my freighter on the next reload, create an auto save from the space station. And see if rolling my save doesn't help. Alrighty, battle time guys, let's go. Last time, I swore I hit the uh, I hit the other frigate last time shooting at this one.
broadcast. <laughs> Jump boots just don't work in the hallway. <laughs> Again, dang it. Mm. All right, all right. Starting to feel the burn, guys. Starting to feel the burn. Sean's going to make me earn it this time. Limit one per sword. <laughs> I'll be honest with you though, if it weren't for uh if it weren't for having to wait another three hours to get another freighter battle, I would all I would almost go ahead and take the A thirty four and come back tomorrow and do it again. <laughs> do it during Zane stream tomorrow or something. Let's see, where is the space station at? Go in here and find an auto save real quick. Hmm. Rolling the timer back a minute on my auto save might help. I don't know. We're gonna try. If I get an S class, y'all be doing this all the time, won't you? <laughs> Saving a freighter, saving a space station, saving a freighter, saving a space station. <laughs> ay, 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 ay. All right, freighter battle night. Save created. Let's roll. Let's do this thing, guys. It's class time. into the system and all the pirate ships explode automatically. It's like, boom. <laughs> they set the self-destructs and hit the life pods. <laughs> oh crap, sword's here. All right, let's make it happen. Oh, All 
crap. The grind is real, guys. S class time. Come on. Give it up. Give it up. S class. No. Crap. Alright. <laughs> it's just now saying hostile ships defeated. <laughs> oh my, come on. Get out of the menu. There we go. <laughs> Dang. I killed them pirates so fast the game can't even keep up with me, guys. <coughs> no, no. I'm in there talking to the captain by the time the pirates are dead. Or by the time the computer catches up to me killing them pirates, man. <laughs> maybe, maybe, maybe I want to switch it up to the photon can and give them a chance. <laughs> All right, all right. Next battle is gonna be photon cannon. <laughs> Swing by the planet and get me a bag of rocks and throw at them. <laughs> oh my! Oh my goodness, that was funny right there. Food on cannon battle, guys. Let's do it. We can do this. Next, you'll get a tilt the screen. I know! <laughs> it ain't fair. We're not letting you have an S class. You're killing too many pirates. Too fast. Oh, what's going on, Caroline? How are you doing? Oh, my. When you did the freighter disappeared with me and. Oh, no! Oh, no! That ain't no good. Did it kill you? <laughs> I don't know. I'm pretty fast with the reloads. I think I think I can reload before the radiation. Solar radiation kills me. All right. Kill the black bar. Oh man, they might have a shot this time. It might take a minute with a photon cannon. Yeah, maybe not. Down, four to go, I believe. goes. Predictable loop. Get right behind him. Next customer. Oh, you gonna go run for the freighter, are you? Say hostile ships defeated. <laughs> Talk to the captain this time, see what happens. Left me floating in space. I had to do a reload, but all good. Yeah, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, got stuck in a freighter engine once. Dang, funny. Cool, cool. Heck yeah. All right. So, not quite as easy with the photon cannon, but still, it's 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 a freighter battle pirates, freighter battle pirates. So you know. Come on, S class. Really? Oh, what a troll. 
Uh, no, not yet, but I will check it out for you. Let's see, leave. All right, cool, cool, cool. Let's uh, reload auto save, and I'll zip over to Discord real quick and see what Caroline posted. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, okay, cool, cool. So you're Caro on the Discord, right? Caroline Carly? Heck yeah. The, 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 I seen that today. The bright father, flying son, and small red fighter called Deadly Daughter. <laughs> Heck yeah. Uh, swords exhaustion, I know. <laughs> oh, definitely go ahead to name a ship that when I get done tonight. <laughs> All right, guys. Cool, cool. Let's do this thing. Heck yeah. All right, all right, all right. Boop, boop. I'll tell you, I may have to go get, I may have to go take them out with the haulers for a while and <laughs> give them a chance. <laughs> This explorer is just too deadly. Start opening up the cockpit and shooting them with a slingshot. <laughs> All right, guys. We're probably going to do a couple more of these if I don't pull an S-Class and we'll go ahead and call it a night. I caught the uh, turret. Holy moly. <laughs> trick landing, man. Trick landing. <laughs> nice. Doing some trick moves in the freighter battles tonight, guys. to reload yeah brutal all right all right all right let's get this let's get this s-class guys start 
charging the blaze jab. It's not an S class this time. We're gonna shoot him in the beak. Oh, time to die, Gekius. Took me a minute to figure out what was going on. I hear you. I'll tell you what, guys. I'm going to take a minute, and we're going to have to clack, click, 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 clack. <laughs> That's right, buddy. <laughs> Give up the S. That's right, man. Shoot him in the face. All right, guys. I'm going to mute out for just a second and uh, while this thing is reloading and uh, step to the restroom because this 20-ounce uh, Red Bull has hit my 18-ounce bladder, and it's time to... Uh, take a little break from the freighter battles and uh that might make it go a few more battles longer than i was that i originally said so let's uh be right back All right, guys, back, back. Okay, I got stuck in some. Or you got got stuck in some anomalous plant life once. Wouldn't let me reload. Oh no, that sucks, Caroline. Caroline, just loaded up my survival game and I loaded the Ford Freighter battle from yesterday. First up, A class. Nice lava lamps and good luck, buddy, man. Hope you get that S class as quick as I did the other night. Took forever to find the right spot to mine my way out. Dang. So I fly into my freighter engine all the time, usually because I'm pulsing towards the freighter and watching the stream at the same time. <laughs> oh my god, that was funny, KJ. Uh, good home in Lava Limps. Heck yeah, heck yeah. Alright guys, time to get serious. It is Cyclotron time from now on in. Yep, we go a cyclotron the wheels off of these guys. Well, the wings anyway. Alright, come on, come on. Come on. Let's get them, get them, get them. Here we go. There, guys, it might be a good sign. Doubtful, but we'll see. <laughs> All right. Oh no, the uh, powered RNG switched up.
let's see. It's that decided to start a new normal. I do my visor first because I woke up on a uranium planet. So I want to fair out together to give uranium. Cool, cool, cool. I made it to my ship before I got the scanner done. Nice. Ah, brutal. In a let's see, KJ, are you on PS4 or PC, KJ? Can't remember. See, you still get the good song when you get to the first space station. Oh, yeah, definitely, definitely. That is my favorite song in No Man's Sky. PC, oh, man. Yeah, I was going to say, if you're starting a new normal mode save, I'd, I'd jump over and drop you some stasis devices. Holy moly at the A classes. Hmm. It's trying to tell me to grab an A34. I think that's what it is. <laughs> Let's see, yeah, funny ups, but I love the song when you I do too. I think that's, like I said, those those two moments or milestones are some of the coolest music in No Man's Sky. Oh. Whew. Let's be honest with you guys, this is probably the longest I've done freighter battles since I, my first freighter. Well, second freighter. <laughs> Guys, it's gonna be S class round right here. Boss battle. <laughs> Dumb cats are having a freighter battle in my kitchen. <laughs> I think I forgot that one. I should probably start a new save to hear it again. I hear you, nice, funny. Heck yeah. I'm, I'm getting to the point where I might have to start a new PSN or start deleting saves. <laughs> oh, let's see. Hashtag bring us to S Class Sean Murray. Heck yeah, man. Oh, man. Almost as bad as S Class Holler hunting right here. Like one more. The, ne the next reload will get it. The next reload will get it. Six hours later, you're still saying the next reload will do it. Another one over here somewhere. Thank you. Oh, man, he flew right underneath me. care <laughs> I forgot how easy normal is but I was going towards the ship if I some cliff didn't tie and perm I'd be dead 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 <laughs> no. oh. yeah perm ain't no joke until you get them shields upgraded normal normal mode's very forgiving <laughs> you know those mountains with sheer cliffs on all sides, I spawned on top one. Holy moly, that sucks! <laughs> oh my god, that's that's when you jump and save your jetpack for the last few feet before you land, soften to blow a little bit. Oh my, 
C-class junk. Are you kidding me? Come on, Gek. I'm gonna tie your horns in knots here in a second. Oh my goodness. Man, I'm glad I got me a comfortable chair for Christmas. <laughs> this would have been brutal in my old chair. I'd have done quit. <laughs> Oh my, I like, I like my lumbar support. Oh my goodness. Almost just finished off the Red Bull, now it's time to get serious. Alright guys, let's get this S-Class guys, let's get this S-Class. Ah, uh, dog on it. All right, let's do this. Do this. Uh, here we go. Hit the X button this time. I'd be an idiot. I had to clap my hands and scare her half to death. She's got eight lives now. <laughs> All right, let's go. Goodness, guys. Finally! <laughs> nice! Another one bites the dust, guys. Alright, you've been sweet. My little orange and black red freighter, but uh, I'm gonna trade you in for this wicked, wicked yellow freaking freighter, guys. Heck yeah! Ah, love it. Heck yeah! Woo! Heck yeah! Thank you, KJ. Thank you, Blista. Thank you, John. Thank you, Lava Lamps. Thank you, Funny Imps. Nice, that is right. Oh, if all your luck is good. Heck yeah, brother, heck yeah. Time for the SSV banana. 
Oh, yeah, I love his class reactions. <laughs> Heck, yeah. I think probably my favorite one of all time was uh, was uh, Zane when he finally got that freaking S class. You could hear him. He he ta he gets up out of his chair at the end of that at the end of that show. He's like he's like I am done. I think um because I think he uh, had an issue with the um, with how to generate it in or something, and he ended up he had, had to wait another three hour period. And then, yeah, it was it was an ungodly amount of time he spent setting that up and 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 fighting for the uh, S class. Up. That's one way of getting rid of him. Trim up this room here. Oh, inventory full. Crud. All right. Oh my goodness, I got an ungodly amount of sodium nitrate. Really? Can go to the freighter. Heck yeah. Crap, crap, crap. Let's see what the chat had to say. Heck yeah. Congrats. Thank you, buddy. Oh, yeah, he was. Death by a thousand warps, I know. First thing first, man. Delete all the default freighter rooms. Start free. Oh, yeah, definitely, dude. Heck yeah. Great stream sword. The S Class Freighter and Holler and 500 subs. Heck yeah. Definitely, definitely top five streams, guys. Definitely. Y'all guys made it happen. Heck yeah. Hey, Caroline. Sorry I was lurking and playing didn't see you. I hear you. I hear you. Yeah, I don't think I've seen a stream with so many accomplished goals. I know, man. I know. Very happy about it, man. Very, very happy about it. All right, let's move that down here. All right, let's go ahead and get back to deleting rooms here, guys. I deliberately didn't set up a base in that other freighter because I knew I'd be trading it for an S class soon, so I just let it ride. So I don't have to worry about uh, collecting my old base. the hallway and we'll start painting this thing black guys black and yellow all right we are here the hallway leading up to the freighter Let's see can I delete any of that I can't nope all right so that's all default let's go with I'm liking like the empty panels. Don't really like that one, but we'll go with it. Alright, let's go with wood grain and black. Alright. One, two, three. Alright, let's move on over here. We're going to do that one as 
well. Alright, cool, 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 cool. Can't do that. Alright, so let's go with the ramp going up. Alright, then we'll go with a ramp going up over here. And it leads up into another long stretch of rooms. Go three deep, two wide. Now give me room to put four refiners in here and then slap a galactic trade terminal up there. <gasps> Dude, I gotta do some base missions on this. I ain't even got the galactic trade terminal blueprint yet. Sweet. I got the uh, large refinery. Do I have? I don't have microprocessors. Okay, cool, cool. Yeah. So I'm saying this save has uh, been highly under underactive <laughs> or under under a, it, advanced. Okay, cool. There we go. Now we need to do, let's do storage containers or storage rooms. Alright, and these switch colors, so you gotta switch it to black again. Okay. That one there, then we do number two, and number three, do number four and five, and we do number six and seven, do number eight and nine. Alright, now we do a hallway down this way. two down and then we'll go back to the freighter rooms switch the color to black cool all right let's do the next one do three on this side and two on the other and I'm out of gold okay cool cool that's all well, at least we got three of them up I don't even think I got that many freighters to run them all right cool cool so now let's go up here and do a couple rooms for a small modest uh, frostwood farm so we'll go four deep. How about that? Four deep and we'll go five wide. And that ought to be all the plants, the complexity on this thing I'll be able to handle. Cool, cool. Liking it. And once I get out of the system, the colors on this thing will look a little bit, a little bit less green. <laughs> all right, guys. Let's see. All right, gonna bounce and eat dinner. Peace, y'all. All right, John Hall. Sorry I missed you until just now, man. Have a great night and enjoy your, enjoy your Brenner, buddy. Heck yeah. Let me ask you this, because I've never tried. If it's time for the freighter battle, it's not the freighter you want. Can you reload and go to a different system until the type you want comes up? Yes, KJ. What what I normally do is when I warp into a freighter battle, if it's something that I like, I'll go ahead and finish the battle and check for an S-Class. If it's something I don't like, like the Sentinel uh, freighter, I'll reload my save right then for, back to where I last saved because I'm usually I'm bouncing around systems, so I, my, my previous saves pretty quickly or pretty early or right before I jump to get the, first, the last time. Then you just bounce around the high economy systems till you get one you like. When you get one you like, then what you do is go into the galactic map, find the system that you were just in, set a waypoint, go back into the space station, reload, and uh, create a new auto save. So that way, every time you reload your save, you can just catch that waypoint every time. But yeah, definitely, definitely. Oh no. Dang, KB died when I typed that. Dang, 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 dang. I need a wire KB. Oh, man. That sucks. Yes, sir, Swifty System Team. Find them all you like and reload back to, to the class you want. Heck yeah. Let's see. Search medium economy too, but the odds are twice as good in high economy systems. Heck yeah, heck yeah, man. How many frigate rooms do you need? I always do five because you, you can have 30... Um, you can have 30 frigates, but there are only five uh, frigate missions available each day. So f you only really need five rooms. Yep, yep, yep. What is going on, Omega AC? High, nice game. Awesome, awesome. 
I played No Man's Sky since 2016. Awesome in PC, 4K, 60. Oh heck yeah, it is a lovely game in in a in a 4K. All right, let's see. Cool, cool, cool. Nice. Heck yeah. Welcome, Pasha. You been lurking this whole time, buddy, or are you or are you just coming back? Definitely, definitely. Glad to have you. I think new comp comes with a KB and gaming mouse. Oh, I think new computer. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Comes with a KB keyboard and a gaming mouse. Ah, cool, cool. I'm picking up the lingo. Heck yeah. Now, so mega, I've seen it played on similar rig. Looks really good in those specs. Heck yeah. Hopefully, hopefully. I'm not. See, I'm. Ah, I'm not really wanting to drop a ton of money on a graphics card when I do this PC but I do want to uh I do want to get a graphics card decent enough to run the uh run No Man's Sky on and I'm thinking hopefully if the price holds of what they've said that it was supposed to price range out at is get more of those uh uh 2060s um RTX 20 um 2060 yeah thinking about picking one of them up with this new uh with this new bill but like I said it's I'm not I'm not getting too much further out of that price range so with the with the PC bill but I'm I'm leaning more towards the uh towards the uh CPU and having the cores and the threads uh to do video editing and video editing and stuff greetings from Brazil man heck yeah welcome welcome nice glad to, and, and you know this is such an awesome this is why i like this game so much guys there's enthusiasts of this game from around the world guys heck yeah all right let's go grab some uh ship tech that's what i was going to do start building that orange candy corn holler tonight guys got the freighter up heck yeah guys s class candy corn holler tonight and then the S-Class Yellow Freighter. It has been a great night. And then on top of that, trip 500 on the odometer with the sub count, guys. Very, very great night. Oh, what am I doing? I don't need any of that cluster for blueprints. I need this. Let's see. I need a scanner module. And do they have a mining beam? No. All right. Let's drop a scanner module in real quick. Cool, cool. All right, let's check ship tech. All right, cool, cool, cool. Let's see. Nothing cooler than listening to the suit lady talking in Russian. <laughs> nice, KJ. All right, let's see what we got here. Cyclotron module, I'll buy that. Let's see, you don't need the phase beam. Okay, cool, cool. Ain't much here for that. So we'll go and roll on to the next system. Heck, yeah. Victory dance. Yeah. All right, guys. Now I got everybody good and dizzy. Let's warp to the next system. Heck, yeah. Glad to have you, Omega AC. Definitely, definitely. All right, let's see what we got going on here, guys. Let's look for some high economy systems, just so I can fill up my uh, my teleporter with high economy systems. Try, we'll try for Corvax high economy. So I'll see if I can find a really cool. See if I can find a really cool explorer popping in. Fonzie, pole. Do you consider it cheating if you have someone join main save and hold expensive items, then join new game to pass those items back so I start with a lot of units? I, no. I honestly, me personally, I don't disagree with because be honest with you, units are so easy to come across anymore uh, as far as grinding that it's not really a grind as much. But then again, you can't really argue the case because then you can go visit uh, other player bases and have 
boatloads of uh, circuit boards or liquid explosives or uh, I will do it I will do it Sophie definitely definitely um, but yeah I mean like I said with the, with the uh, availability of other player bases and farms you know and with randoms just jumping in and giving you uh, just giving you um, uh, what do you call it uh, lost my train of thought yeah, I mean, random just jumping in, giving you stasis devices and stuff. I mean, honestly, I don't, honestly, honestly, I don't consider it cheating. Uh, especially if you have, like, a legacy save that you have, like, really, really built up. And you made them yourself from your legacy. It, it, to me, it's not. I mean, don't get me wrong, but I'm not everybody either, so. But, yeah, I wouldn't think any less of you doing it. Because, to be honest with you, when next dropped... I had a, a whole holler full of a state. What am I doing? I'm going to the wrong side. Um, I had a whole holler full of stasis devices uh, in my legacy save that I passed to Simtex and Simtex passed to me. And we both started out as billionaires on next. So we knew next save. So I, I don't think it, I don't think nothing about it, dude. Definitely, definitely. Let's see. Sounds more like receiving a gift. I, yeah, I agree. Uh, funny. All right, let's see. I need mining beam and scanner. Let's see what he's got. Oh, cool. Got another scanner. Sweet. That'll work. Now, let's pass this scanner over here to my multi-tool. And I'll have to roll these out eventually. But I'm just throwing them in as I go. Let's see. Here we go. Got to get the right, right screen here. Let's see what I got here. I got... Oh man, 65 on the fauna, that sucked. 98 on the fauna. That ain't bad. What's this one? Oh man, that one made me throw up a little bit in my mouth right there. That was pretty brutal with the 6,000 6, on fauna and floor. Let's see what the ship tech guys got for me. Man, you even have an S class? Really? Not one? <sighs> yeah. All right, all right, all right, all right. Next system, guys. I ain't even gonna look at the ships. That guy ain't even got an S-Class ship tech. I'm leaving. Storming out the door, stomping my feet. I'm done. I'm done with the Corvax. All right, next Corvax system. <laughs> See what do we got going on here? Come on, high economy. Where you at? Where you at? Where you at? High economies. There we go. Affluent. I was right on it. There we go. No problem, Sophie. No problem, sweetie. Freaking awesome, guys. My goodness. in the ring of the planet. Cool, cool. My goodness gracious. Ha ha ha. The system is dark because it's sitting in the ring. They didn't pay the power boot, the lights are off. <laughs> hey, are you open? Cool, cool. Still ready, reloading on my freighter battle. Wealthy Corvac system. Good luck, lava lamps. Like I said, sometimes, uh, 
most of the time when I go into freighter battles, I I are I am extremely lucky with freighter battles. Because I hear nightmare stories all the time of it taking 8, 10, 12 hours to get an S-Class. You know, but like I said, you know, what in the world? That's a big rifle right there, guys. A-Class. Cuckoo. Um, but yeah, I hear them horror stories all the time. People complain about it taking 8, 14 hours to get the freighter they want. But yeah, you just got to... You gotta know when to walk away from it too. Let's see, mining beam, we'll take that. Let's go ahead and take this other scanner and we'll get rid of that six and six scanner. Okay, cool, cool. So let's uh let's delete this six thousand and six thousand one. Go ahead and bust that up real quick. Cause we ain't having uh that mess. Alright, let's come on, let's get one about ten thousand. Eh, it's better. Not much, but it's better. Let's drop my mining beam in. There we go. Cool, cool. Alright, so we're going to check the ship tech as well so we're ready to roll out of this system. It's a long runway, so I'm not going to mess around with the reload on this. Oh, brutal. Oh, there's the exotic. Go check him out real quick. I'm gonna land before he does. Coming in hot, baby. Even scan it, just look at it. 16 and 4 and it sucks stats. Ah, nah. I don't really like that high fin one anyway, but I figured I'd check it out. See what she looked like from the buy menu. Alright, let's roll. Next system, guys. Next system. What kind of planet is this? That's something we need to be looking for too. Is exotic planets. You really gonna You really gonna attack me, pirates? I mean, seriously. I just laid waste to like a hundred freaking pirate ships the last two hours. You are really gonna come after me? Let's do this. Let's do this. Oh my goodness. I'm almost embarrassed for you guys. Yeah, you better run. Oh yeah, break out the phase beam. That's all right. Do you, do you need me to start hitting you with the with the pulse spitter again, guys? Or the uh, photon cannon? Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, fly behind the station there. Hide from me. Alright, I've had enough of your phase beam going down, buddy. I can't believe I missed him twice. Especially after laying waste to so many pirates already. Dang it, man! Red Hall Queen. Too bad. Was that it? That was it. Alright, next system, guys. Oi! Alright, next Corvax.
next region here. Looks like a nice cluster of Prosperous right there will take that. Four planets, let's go. Cool, cool, cool. Nice. Heck yeah, guys. Definitely, definitely great job tonight with the likes, the subscribes, and the live chat comments, guys. Very, very much appreciated. Holy moly. All right, guys. Like a long drug out of warp animation. The most beautiful load screens in gaming, guys. Heck yeah. Alright. Rip post system. Cool. I like that. Alrighty, tech time guys, tech time. Heavy Nano Harmonizer, but it's a B class. A boat caster, gonna mind me? Nope. Check the ship tech, see what they got here. Oh my goodness. What is going on here? What is going on? Holy moly. How far behind have I got? There we go. Cool, cool, cool. Nice. Now, let's check for the tech. Really? That's... Oh, okay, cool. Shield module. Well, you know a complete waste of time, Mr. Corvax. Pop reload off just cause of the color of the system, guys. See what rolls in first. Boy. That was a horrendously long reload. Check his first wave, see if something cool pops in, because we are in a wealthy Corvax, and I do like my symmetrical explorers. So We'll see if uh, the RNG will help us out, hook us up with a really cool ship to hunt for next stream. And guys, if you got some really, really cool looking haulers, the ballers, the haulers, or the fighters or whatnot, check out the Noob Nation Discord. Drop those pictures in our screenshot, in our screenshot channel, because uh, I need three more ships to go with this save. And I'm trying to get out of the habit of grabbing the same thing on every save. <laughs> 
but I will be checking the Reddit tomorrow and the uh, Mino and the Discords that I'm in. And we're going to look around and see if we can find some cool ships to go hunt during Zane stream tomorrow. Because uh, now that I got that freighter, I kind of, <laughs> that was kind of my plan for tomorrow if I didn't get it tonight. Was to <laughs> reload my save during Zane stream. <laughs> but heck yeah. Man, I can't even tell what color those systems are because of the glare. Alright. Let's see. Do, 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 do. High economy, come on, where you at? Where you at? For the Corvax to be so smart, they off have an awful lot of poor systems. Alright. My goodness. It's white outside for me. Nice Dark Lord. Enjoy the snow. <laughs> well, if you want it, take it. Um, My wife brought me some. Don't come in here fussing while I'm streaming, please. I told you. You know. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> go, go have me one of the Mike Stockton moments. Sword wants a shuttle. I hear you. I want a shuttle like I want a worse than C class. <laughs> Start. They'll have they'll have D class ships in the next update, guys. Dumper class, five slots, one tech. Alright, what do we got? Oh, cool! Well, they got the cute little, cute little experimental. It's an A-Class. Cool, cool. Nice. Hey, if you have to see one of these in an the S-Class, I would almost be tempted to, to, to trade for one if I run across one. Alright, let's see what we got for tech here, guys. Let's see if we got another scanner or another mining beam. There we go. Need that. Ah, uh, nope. Scatter blaster. Not too bad of a pistol or a rifle system. Let's see what the, the ship tech has in store for me, guys. Really? Oh, pulse engine. I'll take that. Cool, cool. Nice. I like the pulse engine modules. Alright. Now, let's go see what is spawning out on the first wave because this is a short runway. Let's check her out guys. Start a reload here real quick. What I need is a carrier so we can have more ships and flying storage and deployable drones. Oh nice. There there is KJ with the speculation hour. Heck yeah. Oh my definitely definitely we need some new cooler ships I don't everybody wants the multi crew ships and stuff which I mean in itself is a cool idea but I just don't know I don't play multiplayer enough to to really I think it would I think it would entice more multiplayer if it was a carrier ships or like a multi multi crew ships but then then you run across the the uh, problem of a uh, the, who in the four who are the four people in the party would get to fly it and could you fly your or could you fly somebody else's ship situations like that because then you'd have people like well my my carrier ship's a lot or my multiplayer ship's a lot cooler than yours so I'm gonna take mine and then you're back to the same problem where everybody's playing their on their own flying their own ships so. <laughs> all right what is coming in here looks like medium holler shuttle and a medium explorer and a two medium explorers I believe oh, gracious that hey, y'all means it's about that time guys we're gonna hit one more system and I'm gonna probably call it a night
829 and 8. Let's, uh, let's bounce to one more Korvac system. Cross our fingers for a really cool explorer. Let's uh, scan these planets. Let's we'll scan this planet first and then the moon or that other planet behind it. It's going to be Gamma. Let's see what this one's going to be. It's going to be flourishing. Cool, cool. Let's see what this gray rock is going to be. That looks like it might be an exotic planet there, guys. Nope, abandoned planet, cactus flesh. Oh, cool, we got a ring, and it looks like an ice planet right here, too. Let's see, empty planet. Nope, and this is going to be ice bound or frozen or something. Ice bound, haha, <laughs> I called it. Nice. This class, wahoo! Oh, nice lava lamps! Congratulations, dude. I uh, see. I don't care about multiplayer. He he. Just want to deploy drones to a giant gold or silver asteroid, something like that. Cool. Heck yeah. Not a bad idea. Definitely not a bad idea. And I'm almost jealous. Lava lamps getting that S class so quick. That is not bad, dude. Booming Corvax. Let's take that. Heck yeah. <laughs> oh my god, I'm jelly. Heck yeah, grats, lava lamps. Cool, cool. Heck yeah, dude. Awesome, awesome, man. Love it when you get them quick. But then again, I don't mind. I don't mind working for an S class. It wasn't that brutal tonight. <clears throat> I think I started fit. I think I started feeling it more after I got it than I did before I got it. Heck yeah, funny imp says nice job, Lava. Heck yeah. Go ahead and trick that thing out, brother. Ooh, nice. This looks promising right here. Let's see what kind of planet this is. Ah, oh, fungal mold, really? Mm. Let's see what the uh, moon is going to be here. Get lined up enough for it to get a lock on it. Dang. I'm going to go in third person to get this one. First person. There we go. Hold still. Take it. There we go. Gamma intensive moon. So, nope. Here we got Pirates, guys. Come and get some, Mr. Hostile Ships. Holy cow. One down. Getting ready to be two. Dropping like a bad habit here, guys. It's him big as can be. Gotcha. Next customer. Caught him on the fly. It was almost embarrassing, sir. Here we go. I think you are the last one, I believe. Yep. Oh my. You got skill. You got skill, but not enough. Thank you. Up. Oh, that got away from me. That time. Cool, cool. A slight challenge in the pirate ship. Rare in itself. Give me them barrels. Sweet. Alright, let's go check the tech, guys. Let's see, this little snowstorm is trying to cut the power. Just lost the stream in my remote play. Oh no, funny. Brutal, dude. Had to cut the power, had to switch the phone, lousy thumbs. Oh no. Alright, let's see what comes in here. And we'll go check tech real quick. See if we got a nice symmetrical uh, explorer pop in here. It is looking like shuttle. shuttles for days. Okay, let's roll. Alright, let's check the multi-tool, 
And we have a big rifle. Let's see if it's S class. Nope, I do like the blue crystal on it. Alright, let's get the uh I think I need another mine of mean. Make sure. Oh, they got a scanner module, we'll take that. Alright, cool, cool. Let's bust up this bad scanner here. Let's see, it's eight. It's got a nine on the fauna, we'll leave that there. Let's go ahead and bust that because that's kind of the weakest weakest fauna one I got. Go. Oh, what am I doing? That's the mining beam I didn't put in last time, okay. Let's see, scanner module. Let's see what we got, guys. Let's see what we get. Oh, no, that's wrong right there, Sean Murray. You can do better than that. It's so got pulse, shield, hyperdrive, and cyclotron, okay. And I believe I got two more of them in the, uh, or one more of them in the freighter of each. Let's see what we got here. Do, do, do. We have a pulse engine. I'll take that. I'll make, uh, I think I'll make three. Cool, cool. All right. And that's going to be it for this station. Now, let's go check and see if this was a long or short runway. I can't remember. I wasn't paying attention. Uh, it's a medium holler there. It's a short runway, so let's uh, reload the save real quick, guys. All right. We can pick up another pulse pulse engine here guys from the reload and grab another scanner as well all right oh, gracious yeah it's about 20 to 11 now so this will probably be the last station we do tonight but heck yeah it has been a fragging blast tonight guys See what we got going on over here. Cool, cool. Alright, let's see. Come on, something cool flying in so I have something to do tomorrow. Alright. And Definitely, definitely funny imps is a dedicated lurker. <gasps> Ooh, cool. This ain't bad. Little dragonfly wing small. It's symmetrical. Ooh, cool. Red and looks like red and blue. Or red and gray. Let's see what that is. C class. Okay. Yeah, alright. Let's go grab this duplicated tech and, uh, We'll zip on. Well, we'll go ahead and clip it. All right, what we got? What we got? What we got? Let's grab my. Let's grab my scanner module again. Okay. Maybe I'll get a better one this time. But if not, me eh, can't be no worse than what I already got or what it just gave me. Let's grab my. Man, I'm telling you what. I got some cats that don't know how cold it is outside. They are pushing their luck. Alright, let's get the uh, modules installed here in my... Well, I gotta delete the... Uh... There we go. Get rid of that. Jump back over here. Grab the new one. Right, let's see what we got. Oh, that ain't even. Eh. It's better, but not much better. It's not even enough to get excited over right there, guys. That was just kind of sickening. It's medium color. Alright, alright, alright. Right. Cool. So we got the. Uh, we have got the freighter tonight. We have got the candy corn holler, which I'm buying parts for now. Cool, cool, cool. So we're going to bounce back to... Let's jump back to Sword 3 base. That'll be on uh, 
that will be on the uh, Jarrett 7 system or Jarrett 7 planet so we'll bump over there do a hard save and then uh, we'll start closing down the stream guys it has been very very awesome hanging out with each and every one of y'all tonight very glad oh cool new subscriber cool will be cool cool heck yeah definitely loving that last minute sweet okay back to the right menu here sweet sweet nice might be just youtube giving me late notifications you never know sweet loving it guys loving it but yeah man definitely a great stream broke the 500 mark tonight what a huge stream sword well done man way to go thank you KJ let's see that brief power loss reminded me to back up my save I didn't realize I hadn't made a backup in a month dang funny yeah I tell you what dude if you're PS plus funny imps go into your uh go into your settings on the uh, on the uh, manage membership and set up like the, your primary games like if it's no man's sky or all the primary games that you usually play and set it up to where it automatically backs up on the ps4 to the to the uh, ps or ps plus cloud uh every time you put your game in rest mode like when every time you shut down for the night and you put your playstation into rest mode it automatically backs up to the cloud uh your no man's sky content that way you're just doing it daily and you ain't got to uh, you don't have to uh, worry about doing backups man oh cool man i'll check it out real quick let's go look at it let's go check out ah uh, here we go friggin sweet dude that is nice man looks like a looks like a black and a dark blue uh long star destroyer in a s class man sweet very very good find man awesome job lava heck yeah good going man heck yeah sweet sweet okay cool heck yeah will be nice 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 let's see yeah let's set that up i just like to have a little more control and have a manual cool 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 man cool Pasha got no man's sky today sweet dude heck yeah man all right Pasha I'm gonna show you something real quick all right right here is my PSN code or my PSN account it is a all cap sword w o r d 1701 buddy when you get that thing loaded up man shoot me a shoot me a friend request um, I don't do the multiplayer much when I'm off stream, but man, if I see you on and I'm off stream or whatnot, I can jump on. And if you want some help, uh, I know some people don't like getting help on the, on starting out, but if you want some help with some units or whatnot, man, I'll definitely jump in and drop you some stasis devices and you can sell them. They're worth like a uh, 14, 15 million units a piece. So heck yeah, we'll definitely definitely man can we do cross play uh no can't do cross play uh basically you're you're limited to your platform now it might become available later but playstation is notorious for not doing very many games in the cross play but they're starting to open and uh, opening up that uh opening up that that uh area of cross play with different games and they've already got a few game platforms that they do it in, but hopefully we'll get cross play soon. Oh, you're on PC. Gotcha, gotcha. Well, I tell you what, dude. Uh, being on PC, if you uh, if you want to join, I think you did join or may have or whatnot the uh, Noob Nation Nexus. Um, if you're in my Discord, man, just go into the No Man's Sky chat. And just say, hey, I'm a PC player or Steam player or whatnot. I think uh, Caroline Kelly and uh, KJ Hamnick and there's quite a few uh, PC players that's in the Discord that would not mind a bit dropping by and helping out a new player. 
so yeah man definitely definitely if you want some helpful units or whatnot let us know man and if uh if you don't get much response there man i'll put the word out in the amino and get somebody to help you out most definitely dude all right guys i believe that is it for tonight i don't know why i'm jumping back on my ship like i'm going somewhere because my wife brought me some uh salt and pepper chicken tenders from work tonight and they've been sitting over there on the kitchen counter for the last two and a half hours <laughs> will do thank you hey man anytime anytime definitely definitely guys there's a lot of cool cool peeps that play this game and that that are great supporters of this channel and uh, love nothing better than helping out new players to the game because uh really guys you know that's what we do this thing for man so people can see how cool this game is and want to play it and jump in and do it man heck yeah and thank you too lava lamps for uh hanging out with me man you've been here for probably the whole stream i believe i think i seen you pop in like the first couple minutes so heck yeah man appreciate all my lurkers out there and guys thank you thank you all for the 500 subs tonight that you just don't know what a milestone that is for me um heck yeah <laughs> just a uh, heck yeah thank you dude thank you oh my goodness guys yeah thanks to everybody that came out tonight to hang out in the stream man i know we got up there clipping around 30 alexi check oh my god dude you still around oh that's right you working nights today okay okay heck yeah man definitely definitely glad to have alexi check in the chat man posh you send me a friend request on steam i'm no man's sky player or nms player if you have any questions don't be afraid to jump in chat and grab me heck yeah and dude if you got any questions and you're in my discord man i literally and this goes out to everybody if you want to get a hold of me when you don't see me online or whatnot at me in the discord now, if I'm asleep, I'm not going to reply. But yeah, if I, I'm usually the at, so usually give me a, will give me an alert that I got a message, and I will go check it out. So yeah, guys, definitely, definitely a great way of getting a hold of me. But you know, we got a lot of cool peeps in the Discord that uh, share a lot of cool pics and uh, ship locations and discoveries. So definitely, definitely, guys, check it out. Great stream as usual, but this one was special very very special guys i mean seriously guys 500 subs i still don't i still can't wrap my head around it i really can't i mean oh man <laughs> just oh man is y'all guys have been so awesome really i mean just really awesome i can't thank you enough i really can't um my goodness yeah Y'all guys gonna get me choked up. <laughs> Alright guys. Alright guys. Let me go ahead and jump off here. Go eat me some dinner. Watch a little TV. And uh, get sorted out for bed tonight. Definitely, definitely. Be keeping an eye out for the stream tomorrow night. Unless something drastic, major, or unforeseen happens tomorrow afternoon. I will definitely, definitely have major plans on going live after Zane's stream. Or after dinner tomorrow afternoon. Hopefully, and we'll go ahead and trick out this holler or maybe jump on the permadeath. I ain't quite sure what we're going to be do, doing, but it's going to be something something I can hang out with you guys on. So uh, definitely, definitely, guys, keep an eye out. Hit that bell button so you'll get notifications for the stream when we go live. And uh, if you're in the Discord, I always post up links on the self-promotion. And if you guys stream, if you guys put up any content, join that Discord and... Uh, Speaking of that self-promotion link, guys, y'all are free and welcome at any time posting links to your content so we'll know what know to look out for you. So y'all guys get it done. And uh, Definitely, guys. Have a great one. See you, Pwn Stream. Heck yeah, buddy. Appreciate you hanging out. Appreciate all my lurkers. Appreciate all my chatters. Guys, have a great night. We'll see you tomorrow.